Hello, hello, and welcome to Coffee Craft Season 2, The Sky Blockening. Uh, <laughs> Alright, all joking aside, well, no, there's going to be a lot of joking. Uh, here is the deal. For Season 2, we're taking a little break from Vanilla Minecraft until we get both our caves and our cliffs and our caves and cliffs update. And we're going to play some Skyblock. If you're not familiar with what Skyblock is, Skyblock is it's an umbrella term that covers a, a variety of different variants. And the, the basic idea is you get a tiny little island suspended over the void of sadness and death. And uh, there's a little starter box in there. And your job is to grow the island. And in the case of you Skyblock Revived, which is the particular version that we're using... Your goal is to uh, manage challenges. So you got some novice level challenges where, you know, you get collect 64 cobblestone, get some leather and maybe a book if you're lucky. You know, collect some apples and get extra saplings and so on and so forth. As you progress throughout the little quests, you'll level up your island. Uh, also, to level up your island, you need to expand it out. Some of that will come from getting blocks as a part of these challenges. And some of that comes from your knowledge of Minecraft mechanics. Sorry, it's nighttime. Of course, it's always nighttime when I log into the server and I have no bed. Um, for example, one of the big mechanics that we'll need to make a lot of use of is a cobblestone generator. When lava flows into running water, it forms cobblestone. This is the variant that we're going to have to use, and I'll circle back around to why in a minute. But the, the this is, again, where, where some of the challenge of Skyblock comes in, because, you know, if that's, if that's all the island you have, how do you grow it? Well, Cobblestone Genera lets you get some more cobblestone. That's good for a bit, uh, but nobody wants an island of just cobblestone. So, oh, that's right. You got a tree. If you get enough cobblestone, you can make a furnace. And then with the furnace, you can cook a log to get charcoal, which you can use to cook the cobble to get stone. And and, and now you start to see how this goes. This is, this is a challenge to see how well you know your Minecraft game mechanics. Uh, one addition to, to kind of get a little, take the edge off the grind, we are using the custom origin plugin. So, unfortunately, the custom origin plugin only recognizes cobblestone generators like the one in the display there. Uh, fortunately, what it will do is it will level up as we level up our island. So, if I can find the button, I was trying to do that all slick without looking and I couldn't. So, the way we've got this set up. Now, this is completely configurable. The four of us sat together, we figured out what we wanted it to do, what we didn't want it to do, and the numbers and so forth. So, your island starts off at level 1.4, 1.6, something like that. So, if you lose, if your level drops below that, it's because you lost stuff. At island level 1 through 19, you're at the beginner level. Your cobblestone generator gives you nothing but cobblestone. When you get your island up to level 20, you'll get the novice generator, which means there's a 1% chance for, instead of cobblestone, andesite to appear. There's a 1% chance for diorite to appear. There's a 1% chance for granite to appear. You got a 0.25% chance of clay to appear. And so on and so forth, as you can see on the chart on the screen. So, you really do want to level your island as you go. Part of that is going to be what blocks you use to build your island. Like, you know, cobblestone is worth a certain score. Stone is worth a certain score. Uh, stone brick is worth a particular score. So on and so forth. Uh, and each block counts towards that score up until a point of diminishing returns. So... You know, <laughs> die all right. Thank you. Uh, oh, I do have chat up there. Okay. Uh, so, easily distracted already, and we just got started. Uh, so, you want to make sure that you vary up the blocks a little bit. You want to make sure that you 
uh, build with a bunch of different blocks because it will help your island score and that will help you get to the better level uh, generator and, and you can see how it all you know builds on itself from there so one of the reasons why we chose use skyblock is it's pretty simple and straightforward. Like there, there's other sky, like uh, there, there's Iridium Skyblock and some other servers that I, the challenges are intricate and complex and there's daily missions and there's a bank and there's things you can buy and uh, it, it is super intricate. Far more than we wanted to do this go around. The flip side is, is you could do something like Skyblock Evolution where everybody's on a single island. And if you saw how much space the four of us took up uh, <laughs> on a uh, on a vanilla world, you can imagine what four of us on one of these little guys, uh, yeah, somebody was going to get pushed off the ledge into the void of sadness and death. Um, intentionally or not is a, an open question. Uh, I refuse to answer. <clears throat> so we each get our own island uh that's somebody's island there that's somebody's island there uh there's mine over there and i think rayest is off that way a little bit too oh and we are playing with the data packs that we did in season one so we've got our little uh shrine there for the armor stand book we've got just about everything except for the player graves because it doesn't work right with um, Skyblock. Basically, when we did a little test run and we found that if you died on somebody else's island, um, you couldn't get your stuff back from your own grave. That that seemed that seemed counterproductive. So there are no player graves, uh, but otherwise, and oh, and we did add a durability ping. So that way you get a little bit of warning when your stuff gets down to about 10%. Each individual can customize it uh, to be an audible or like something super noticeable or, or something kind of subtle. Um, Spawn Island over here has some tips and tricks and other fun stuff. I may do a walk around in a produced video later. But with the dawn, let's get the rest of the crew in and then we can get to our island and get building. Hello. Hello. Is it time to push the button? It's time to push the button. Yay. Let's do this. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know if you guys noticed, um, but everybody's got a sl at least one slime chunk below level 40. Mm. And there's a few other hints worth uh, taking oh, a look at, too. Oh, you guys changed your clothes. Yeah, yeah I figured I would need to yeah. get ready for some heavy work, so... <laughs> oh, you roll. changed your species. Well, no, I went, I went to my normal <laughs> species. I, I took the, the costume off. Yeah, this, this, is, this is me. Okay, in all my glory. Are, are you social distancing? What's, what's going on right now? Oh, you have cargo yeah. pants! Yeah, I yeah. Of course, he has cargo that. pants. What medic doesn't have cargo pants? As, as long as, uh, as long as you guys, you know, stay back there, then you know I don't need like you know the gloves. <laughs> or I don't need the mask. Nice. You know, so, so <laughs> I love good, it. But I gotta put those back on, you know, because <laughs> okay. I get to my island. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, if you haven't already, uh, run around, check all the signs, and pick up your armor stand book if you want. The shrine is uh, somewhat less spectacular than it was last season. Uh, just walk right up to it, and it should give it to you if it's not already in your inventory. Okay, there we go. I, I, I know Rast was going to go right I for that. got a book! <laughs> Why is there a... Oh, no! Well, what? Oh, okay, no, that's glass. glass. Uh, that's admin island down there. <laughs> All right, let's uh return. Are you gonna home? walk people through the signs? Uh, I was gonna do that in a in a video. <clears throat> okay. There is my wonderful view of Spawn Island. Uh, I've got a neighbor over there, a neighbor over there. And 
Everybody starts with this sign, <laughs> which you can right-click okay. to bring up the island menu, or slash is will bring up the island menu, Water, which you can use to... space, space, lava. Okay. Oh, 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 okay. I gotcha. I gotcha. <laughs> I was trying to figure out, like, what... what this is our starting. This is our starting chest. Everybody's starting with the same deal. Uh, the default use sky block does not include the bone meal or the extra oak sapling. But two out of four islands uh, had their tree not drop a single sapling <laughs> when it was taken down. So, in the interest like of huh? Like mine, mine didn't drop a sapling this time. It gave me an apple. Oh, this time? <laughs> oh, yeah, this time. Uh, so. I went in and added an extra sapling in the box just in case sadness occurred. Um, <laughs> hey, where's uh? Oh, Minecraft is quiet. Oh, oh, sadness! I didn't get a sapling either. Jerk! <laughs> That's a mean tree. I'm just saying. <laughs> I guess he got one. <laughs> nope, I haven't. I haven't even cut my tree down yet. I didn't get one either. Oh, oh man, some bad luck. Oh, no. I know. Like that, that's not a good start. I Seriously, all this grass, and I'm gonna get what one wheat seed. I got some mm. flowers though. I don't want flowers though. Gonna hold on to that bone meal for now. Uh, I thought so, but I also know my luck in getting uh, getting the wheat to grow in any kind of timely fashion. So, <laughs> all right, that's fair. I can't, I can't hit on that. Um, I think I want to move some stuff around. Two block all the way around. All right. Yeah, I'm still. I'm still a little cranky about the uh, hey. the, the cobble generator only working a particular way. I got three sap or two saplings. Ooh, nice. Hey, you go on with your bed, so. Heck yeah, it's about time. All right. Let's... All right. Well, that's fair. You uh, you didn't have very much luck on the test. No. I didn't. No. Speaking of which, we only ran the test for like. A day, so yeah. Don't even think we're like you know. And not all of us played on it all that long. <laughs> How do you already have a stone axe? I got stone from the cobble generator. That's it. Yeah. I don't have a stone axe. Dude, I just got wood. I family friendly. Seriously. All right, I am going to do a different type of cobblestone generator, only for the first little bit. I'll change this up when I get to level 20, but in the meantime... Oh, I forgot. Is that where the... Okay, no, that's not where the sky falls in. But... I do... Really need this turned a different way. Doing its thing. So What's doing what thing? You was talking to myself. Hmm? Leave me be, I'm talking to my stuff. Uh, I lost two dirts. No. How? They, they fell into the void. Oh. Hey. So. You, your dirt is now void. Yep. Man. Okay. Well, it looks like we're back to basics, so... Uh, <laughs> yeah. Let's, uh, let's go around. Let's, uh, let's, let's start with a good one. What is everyone's favorite specialty coffee? Specialty coffee? Uh, all yeah. coffee is special. Or free stuff. Okay. I was about to um, say, that's like asking everybody's special dog. All well, dogs are special, so... 
Oh, Some goodness. dogs are more special than others. I know one others. dog that's specialer than others. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a hard time remembering what to do here. Yeah, uh, so I got a tree. Huh? What's the huh? Another tree? Uh, so I'm holding a wooden shovel. Mm -hmm. And I dug up dirt. Mm -hmm. And I got a ding that said... Netherite oh. chess piece durability low. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I've been getting some weird ones like that. Oh. Uh, that might... I wonder if the durability ping is broken. <laughs> I would... Senior I would admin. Sure, yeah. Oh. Uh... Uh, oh. Three saplings. Thank you. <laughs> Alright. Oh. Uh... I don't have to make the fancy water right now. Nope. So I can do the e <laughs> thingy thing. The fancy water. You, you don't have to make a uh, sparkling generator just yet. Oh! Yeah. What in the world? You yeah, didn't believe me? Go. No, I didn't. <laughs> Surprise. I don't see where I can modify the settings for that either. Uh, it's slash trigger... Uh, okay. It's one of those. It, there, there's not a graphical... Alright. Uh, what else can I plant right I now? I put the ice down and then I pick it to get the water? No, you just do a normal break. Okay. I know what I did wrong. Okay. All right. I'll fix it later. This is the way we break the cobble. Break the cobble. Break the cobble. <laughs> um, yeah, I think I might have to log back in with the admin account later and uh, just remove the durability ping. It doesn't seem to be correctly identifying items. Which is a shame. It, it thinks my, my wooden pick is netherite leggings. Yeah. He's telling me I have a crossbow. Right, I, I, remind I, me? I could only dream of having netherite leggings right now. <laughs> it's... I think you could dream that. To make the cobbly column... Mm-hmm. It's water first, space lava, or water space space lava? No. Lava first. Well, depends. On? You, uh, I don't have an elytra. Thanks for reminding me, jerk. All right. Oh, I need. I need shelter. Cause uh, this ain't gonna be good. Hmm. Where did the random tall grass come from? It gave me nothing. No, 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 it's night. Uh -huh. I don't want it. Yeah, that's why I just put a quick cobblestone roof over my head, because uh, the night, it brings phantoms. Wait, don't we have three days? Yes, you have three days. Hey, don't be mean to me. Oh, my netherite chest plate is low. Yeah. Oh, my leggings are. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. That, that's the one thing I wasn't expecting. All right. Uh, it's all good. Uh, what about the Spanish Inquisition? <laughs> Something like that. Okay. Nobody still answered my question, though. Which question? The question was, is it 
lava, space water, lava, space, space water, or water, space, lava, water, space, space, lava? It's two spaces because lava is just going to flow down in a single column and then branch once it reaches, you know, wherever. Okay. Um, oh, okay. Okay. Sorry. I, I was missing context for your question. I said to you make the it, column. Yeah, you want it to aim it to where one fan of water and one fan of lava are touching. So I'm not sure. When you let your lava go, that's when you're going to find out if it's two spaces or three. Because that's going to show you how far away everything flows. Okay. And I put it on the edge or I put it on the top? I would recommend edge. putting it on the edge. Because if you put it on the top, you won't have anywhere to run. <laughs> All right, so the lava is flowing, and I got to give it a second to do its mojo. Yeah, like a long, long second, because it's gonna take a minute. Apparently, we're like a hundred and some odd blocks in the air. Yeah, we're we should be a hundred and fifty at the top of the island. You need to turn toggle trigger. Yeah, I. I... I know we had some problems with the clock when we were testing, but I figured it was worth keeping, if only for the fact that it really is useful to uh, to to know uh, your elevation. Yeah, I'm at 150, so I guess all of us are technically at 150. Yeah, yeah, all our islands start at the same elevation. How do I know if it's done? You don't. That's one of the joys and frustrations. How long should I wait? A reasonable amount of time. You're not funny. <laughs> I don't know. Somebody's laughing. By morning it should be done, right? Maybe. Oh, where did... Okay. I was going to get mad if that disappeared. Oh. <laughs> Stupid box. Oh, me. Fine. All right. Let's, uh expand out the island a little bit, shall we? <coughs> Everybody have their uh, shift... Oh, okay, so that's where I asked over there. I wonder how I can tell. How you know? Oh. Oh, look at my lava for me! Is it moving? Yes, it's still moving. It's gonna take a while. It's lava. Uh-huh. Oh, now my nether light leggings are low. Yeah. I'm going to work on that. Oh, there's a very far down there, down there. <laughs> yes, there's a very... It's 150 blocks down there, down there. It takes a little while. Oh, come on, tree. Man, you, uh... You're cranking through those advancements there, Medic. Uh... No. No? <laughs> if you saw my island, you're like, dude, what have you been doing? <laughs> I Do just you want to look at my lava again for me? Oh, no, my elytra's low. <gasps> what was that, huh? I watched in a non-screen. Oh. Why are you watching my screen? 
You get your own because island to worry it about. Looks scary. Because I'm giving you viewers. Thank you. <laughs> that wasn't what I meant by that. <laughs> I'm sorry. Is it ready now? My my heart rate just accelerated. Excuse me while I stand precariously on this ledge. Hun, do you think my love is ready now? Not likely. Lava flows really slow. Lava flows stupidly slow. Lava hurts my soul. All right, that's my center line. <coughs> There's the sun. Here comes the sun. Oh, wait, no. No, thank you. <laughs> it seems, uh... More British TV shows are about to uh, make their way to the States. In a good way? Maybe. That, that's, that's not a good answer. <laughs> what, was that not the maybe you were looking for? That didn't sound like a good maybe is all I'm saying. Mm, no, because it's probably not a good maybe. <laughs> well, at least you can admit it. Yeah. Uh, the the show is going to make its way to Netflix. It's called Sexy Beasts. The idea is to be a dating show where <laughs> the participants don't judge each other based on appearance. So everybody gets put in a costume. That sounds British. Oh. <laughs> and so they go through all the dating show rigmarole in a costume, which finally gets revealed. To which on oh, Cord Killers, no, Brian no, said, Oh, I, I always wanted to watch Dragon Con, the TV show. <laughs> they do have that panel, don't they? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> How about now? It should be good. Maybe. Okay. And don't put it next to the lava. Put it one more over. Yes. yes. You're already worried about making a, uh, <clears throat> a way down, and I'm just trying to get enough cobble to um, <laughs> live. No, that, that's one too far away. Down? That's one too far what away. What do you mean? The, the lava needs to flow into the running water, so you need to move your water over one. And I love how you're just far enough away that I can see the island and the, the other blocks, but you're too far away for entities to render, so I don't see you. That's adorable. <laughs> It's actually not the, the enough cobble to live that has me worried. It's the enough food to live that has me worried. How about now? Uh, sorry, I'm... There we go. Do you now see the column firing? Yay! Yeah, now you gotta... As long as it took for... Uh, as long as you waited for that first column to form... I need more cobble. Although the main objective here was to get a little platform so I could start collecting dirt from the underside of the island. Be very careful with that block. <laughs> That's where the lava source is. I should be able to get that one okay. Oh. I forgot to put something on the back side of the lava source. I'll do that in a minute. Uh, I forgot to leave myself a way up, too. Right, 
I'll have to get a proper proper set of stairs here soon too. Grow wheat. Something? Anything? Yeah, make sure you don't uh, lose your grass blocks either. Because uh, you get given dirt, not grass. Yeah, I was making my cobblestone generator and immediately turned it into obsidian. Oh, <laughs> oops. Fire took off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's for sure. Wish the sapling would grow already. Uh, yeah, I'm glad I'm not the only one sitting there going like, "Grow, Whoa. you fool!" Wow. Like the minute that came out of my mouth, it grew. Mm -hmm. It's taunting you. <laughs> Let's start saying it after I put it down. Jeez. Well, that's all it takes. I wish the sapling would grow. <laughs> well, laugh. Mine, mine's not. Okay. <laughs> hey, four saplings. I'm rich. Oh, hush. I'm going to Vegas. I'm going to Tree Vegas. Tree Vegas. Oh. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fun little song. What was that? I think I know what's going on. That was that was my uh, that was my my Reyes song. <laughs> Your pitch wasn't was, quite right. Yeah, I wasn't gonna say that, but that was the Deep House remix. That's what that was. <laughs> oh, that early game life. Hey. I think we'll be doing early game life for a while. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Furnace. Oh. Need that stupid tree um, to grow. Oh. Oh. It's magic. There are fishes. Are they so delicious? <laughs> I don't know. I can't figure out how to catch them. I don't have a sword. Use well, punch them uh, or bucket. use a bucket. <gasps> what? Using a bucket or? <laughs> Careful though, you're gonna have to put them into like a, a block somewhere, because otherwise you'll flood out whatever you put them on. <laughs> you're fishy, 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 fishy. Okay, just making sure you had a hole to put them in. I saw something moving out of my periphery, and I didn't know what it was. Oh, there are lots of fishies down there. One fish, two fish? Come um, fishies. Does this one have a little car? Come to me. <laughs> Does that one have oh, a little no. star? Tapped out. <clears throat> right, um... Crossbow durability low now. That's interesting. Yeah. I know, I know, I know. I'm going to fix it. I'm going to fix it. No, I'm just having fun saying the names. <laughs> oh, there goes my another one right hoe. And. <laughs> my kingdom for another right hoe. It fishes. Oh. You know, it's really sad. Right. We could sing the song about the delicious fishes. But I don't know if some of our youngest audience members are old enough to know it. Hush. <laughs> we will not speak of such things. Mm, it's okay. You know the the most awesome uh, Elder Scroll title, Oblivion. Uh oh. Do you mm -hmm. do you 
Do you know it turned like Shut thirteen up. today? Yeah, I was trying not to think about that either. To be completely honest. But <laughs> do it. It's in your butt. Eh, well, you know. No, no, oh, oh. <laughs> that 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 was not trying to be. Oh yes, thank you. Yeah, that <laughs> is happening. <laughs> That wasn't my uh, my Reyes impersonation. That was my true. No, 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 no. Okay. Let's see if I do that. I'm miss mending. <laughs> uh, you'll get it sooner or later. Oh, All right. If you do that? slash trigger duraping, you can actually uh, hide the display. So it at least won't, uh... But I'm having fun with it. Okay. I'm not. I am so not. I'm sorry. It irks me. I find it irksome. <laughs> What's the bone meal in here for? Alright, here's a test of your uh, game mechanics. Why would there be bone meal in there? To grow a tree? Why else would there be bone meal there? To grow a tree. Why else would there be bone meal there? There's no point in testing my mechanics. My mechanics that I know of are, is it pretty? <clears throat> I'm trying to argue with that. I really am. Give me a minute. Okay. Keep trying. Tree grow, please. Maybe if I put water next to it? Uh, no. Light level will affect it more than anything else. Well, it doesn't get more lit up than on my island. You're saying your island is lit? It is. Works. Oh, come on. fussing so hard about this staircase. It's not going to be there for long. No, the bone meal is there so that way you can grow grass to get wheat seeds. <coughs> oh. Well, I'm glad... I asked before using that. <laughs> I was not going to get that right. Uh, it makes you feel any better, Race. I didn't know either. <laughs> really? Dude, I, I told you before we even no! started this, I don't have much in the way of mechanic knowledge either. Dumb tree. What? <clears throat> it's not grown yet? No, it grew, but it gave me literally a sapling. Oh. <laughs> I know. At least yours grew. Oh. Mine's still sitting here like... Yay! I got me a head. I mean, I mean, um... Uh, fishy fed me. Yay. <laughs> Are you already starting your head collection? Yep. <laughs> Sounds <laughs> like it. That's the way I'm gonna have to. Is, is that the is that the new game prayer? <laughs> what? Please don't fall. Yes, yes and I didn't. <laughs> okay. Uh, 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 it back in there. Just oh, in doggone it! Okay, fine. Okay. 
I'm suddenly in a mild panic attack about uh, phantom noises. But they haven't started yet, have they? I don't. For me. No, not yet. We have one more night. Maybe. They, yeah, they didn't start for me yet either, so. But they're going to start They'll early start for, soon. A, for a non. <laughs> because the non was on earlier than us. He's not going to share him, is he? Might. Uh, he spawns to your place. I, I, really <laughs> I mean, I, I can go visit the island if you. If, I can go visit your island if you'd like. No, thank you. Not like that. Slash no. is space no <laughs> spawn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If sharing phantoms is a thing, then we're all screwed. Just saying. Yeah. Yeah. I'm coming to visit. I brought friends. Thanks. I'm going to do that all the time if that's a thing. What? Bring friends? Bring fans. Go. Oh no, they're here for me. Somebody else get them. <laughs> I don't own a sword. She's going to be like IS. Actually, <laughs> slash. that reminds me. I probably should put together a sword now that I got some more cobble. How do you think I've been getting my fishies? I don't know how you've been getting your fishies. They jumped up in the bucket? Because, you know what? Medic's not starving. Yeah, I'll get to that. How'd you complete the the, the generator? You, you get 64 cobble. On your uh, slash IS, you go to the challenges. When you've got whatever it says, like um, if you hover over the cobblestone generator challenge, it says this challenge requires 64 cobble. So when you have 64 cobble on your person, you click that and you'll get three leather and a 20% chance to get a book. 10 currency that we don't use, and 10 XP. And you can complete it multiple times. It just gets harder each time. Well, and that right. goes for all the challenges. Uh, there's also a shortcut command to get to the challenges, too. Slash challenges. Oh, okay. Have better luck if I have to remember is one code. So. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't don't hear it. I'm not saying like everything you need to do you, you can get from the the slash is. This so is if you get if you get the short term memory problems like I do, um, <laughs> it's <laughs> not the game for lag. I am literally just standing here bouncing up and down like I'm jumping on a bed. Why? Mm. Invisible block, log in and out. I, I'm jumping all over. Oh, never mind. It was my controller. Oh. <laughs> That's terrifying. That's yeah, frustrating. I'm to be having that. That's, yeah. that's what I said. This is, this is not the game to be... <laughs> oh, yeah, to be having uh, problems with your, with your keyboard? Lava? Yeah. Correct. <laughs> all right. And then if I put the lava on here... Just gonna randomly run run to the left here. Whee. <laughs> It'll go there, and now put I safety let rails it on your island. Thing. Let's mm -hmm. see if I put the lime in the coconut, and then I drink it all up. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I want to say I couldn't help yep. it, but I totally I could. You. I want you. Okay. No, we'll have to try Pixelmon another day, but I, I don't know that I get the chops to set one of the servers up yet. Pixelmon? Yeah. Really? Oh, uh, dude, that's going to be awesome. I didn't know you were into Pixelmon. I'm not. Oh. But she said, I choose you, and that's all I could think of was you playing Pixelmon. Yeah, well, you know. There's a, there's a gentleman setting up a brand new server, um, so I'm waiting for it to go live and until then all I hear is the discord channel just going crazy non-stop <laughs> if I'm at my computer <laughs> I was going to use that for fuel but my tree hasn't grown jerk torches One torch. Actually, I 
wonder if that little safety roof there isn't causing part of the problem. Now, is it your island level, or do you have to complete every challenge before you get the next set of challenges? Um, you have to complete a certain number of the challenges at that level and have ah. your island at a certain level. Okay. So uh, you'll notice the different color glasses because, uh, like... Uh, one of them just requires you to complete the cobblestone generator and novice builder. Novice builder is for each island level 20. Um, if you hover over the glass, it'll tell you what it requires for you to unlock that. So some of them, it's just your island. Some of it's your island level and a previous challenge. Um, and it gets fun. Okay. Cool, cool. Not if my tree doesn't grow. That's not cool. Okay. That's oh. the reason why I got up there. To put a torch up there. Oh, I said if this guy's feeling better. My tree hasn't grown yet either, so. No, that doesn't make me feel any better. And I'm burning more cobblestone than I'm picking up. Oof. That's, uh, that's not good. Put a box over your lava. I did. Well, I put oh. a slab over it. Yeah. Yeah, I put a chest over it. So that Because the chest is just big enough that it keeps stuff from falling in, but just small enough that you actually get light out from under the lava. So it helps light up the island a little bit. Hmm. Uh, my island yeah, I'm just no crazy. Island. I leave it open. Uh, no, uh, man. <laughs> nope. <laughs> yeah, my island's not going to be 30 by 30 anytime soon, so uh, I'm not worried about light levels right now. <laughs> Three. We'll go four. Then... I almost have a full row of cobble now. Whoop, whoop. Dirt. Two, no, down to go, three, down. four. Good four, come on. One, two. Oh, I was one away. Um, my pickaxe broke. Oh. Up tree. Yeah, I, I'm, as much as I really want to get the cobble gen challenge going, I need to. I need to get. I need to build out some more platforms and stuff. <laughs> nice. Oh, hey. Okay, that's how you do it. Yep, that's how you do it. I got me three leather. I got me three leather. Uh, if I might make a recommendation, instead of making leather armor with those, you might want to save that for books. Oh, too late. I made a, uh, <laughs> uh item frame. <laughs> <laughs> I made an item frame for my, uh, for my first fish caught. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> well, okay then. No, I'm just joking. I wouldn't do that. It's all priorities. Uh, yes, you would do that. I don't 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 <laughs> lie like that on air. <laughs> Deep in here, you're right. I would. <laughs> One, two. All right, now to replenish what I just lost from doing the challenge. That's seven. That's... <laughs> no, too far. Did I lose one? Oh, no.
<laughs> Uh-oh. Nothing to see. What is that laugh about? No, nothing to see here. I would greatly appreciate if Mr. Pumpkin would grow. I think you're asking too much, sir. I mean... Need to make a fish pond here soon. Bust the block underneath it. Will my island sign disappear? Yes, uh, but if you you can you can put a sign down, put slash is in square brackets, and it will do the same function. It just won't look as pretty, which I know matters to some people. I guess I just well, that's okay. You can stay my grass block. I'm okay with that. I mean, you are going to want to make sure that you keep one. At least one. Yeah. Maybe it's not a square block. No, oh, no square brackets. Just slash IS on the sign. Short-term memory, something or other. in case, heaven forbid, the unfortunate happen. Yeah, that would be bad. <laughs> You're telling me. that all that i'm trying to get multiple trees going or multiple saplings now that i can going that i can look sadly at you know what i miss having a guardian farm where you get all the lighting you ever need you kind of forget what those conveniences are like until they're not there You know? Hey, Beast Lord! How's it going? Thank you for the raid. Beast Lord, welcome in. How's it going? It's a uh, very early game Minecraft. <laughs> oh. It's the beast. Oh. Oh. Ah. Fall. 
No. My uh, pickaxe broke, and I only got two of the three cobble that I needed to get another one. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh. Well, you can always oh, pop how about over this? here. How about this? You bring me that poppy you got, and I'll let you have a full stack of cobble. You, what, you need a poppy that bad? No, but I figure you need cobble, and I want that flower, so... To grow a flower. <laughs> nah, I ain't wasting my bone meal right now. <laughs> <laughs> so someone's gonna need something eventually. <laughs> nah. Uh start up that honey fun. Yay oh, tree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have neither tree nor food at the moment. Oh, How's it going, One Winged right? Angel? I, I can't remember if I said hello when you got here. No. It's that short-term memory thing. Can't remember what it's called. Hello! One Wing, how's it going? <laughs> one bit of hey, wheat. Hey, hey, One Wing. Is it one bit of wheat? One bite of wheat? Uh, one, I'm sorry, you're not going to eat that of wheat? I don't know. Good question. One, right. one tusk. Tusk? Tusk or husk? Husk, tusk, tusk. <laughs> I don't know. Tuscans don't taste very good. No, we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. It's uh. Jason. It's, <laughs> it's that it's that early game Minecraft when you're sitting there going, "Okay, I have two cobble and a stick. What can I do with two cobble and a stick? Not much." <laughs> No, it is most definitely not a gluten-free riddle. Oh! Uh, come on, come on. Why are you not getting in my inventory? Maybe it doesn't want to. It's glitchy. No! <coughs> this is one of those things where I have to... Ooh. Hmm? Ooh. Yep. Okay, so we have that glitch now where... Things are going to be on the ground, and you have to go up to where they were originally created to get. Oh, them. yeah, yeah. I thought the update to the fast leaf decay would have fixed that, but uh, I don't know that that's that. I don't. I don't think that's a problem with that. Hey, Beast Lord, how's it going? I, I deeply appreciate. The, oh, <laughs> yeah. Sound issues are uh, interesting. Yeah. That, that is the Minecraft aesthetic. Uh, I should probably not be out from under the cover at the moment. <laughs> the joys of early game Minecraft when you got to worry about phantoms and a lack of armor and cheap tools that are about to break and a tree that won't grow. Uh, you know. You don't have feelings about that at all, do you? No. Nah, no part, no feelings. <laughs> I, I now need to work the night away because I need to actually get a little more cobble anyway uh, oh, let me head down to my little hideout make another uh, oh. maybe it's time to move storage under there too Oh, except for the part that I put the chest over the lava. I'm going to have to do something about that first. Yep. Yay, I have fish cooking. Woohoo! Yeah, I, I got to get a fishing hole set up here in a minute, in a, soon enough. I used uh, stairs to protect the waterlogged blocks. Yeah, one wing. I like the uh, pixelated rain too, especially the rain sounds. It's a good time to go fishing. If you got the string in a fishing pole. Which nobody does. <laughs> I don't think anyone's got that right now. No, not yet. What I do have is some cooked fish. Which I just num num on. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm already down a haunch and a half of hunger. I might have taken a small fall. You know, before I got a food supply laid in. Back to the cobblestone grind. Yeah. 
Uh, I swear the night's going to get worked. Oh. Mm. I can't wait till I get some iron and I can get a more uh, lossless cobblestone generator put together. The uh <laughs> Yeah, that's one way you are. Yeah. Yeah. I, I I do like the sound of rain in general. Uh I don't I don't know if this is uh generated or some poor <laughs> some poor sound engineer had to go out in the rain with a microphone and, <laughs> and capture something. That would be hilarious. Uh, it's certainly not without precedent. You know what? If you wanna, if you wanna pay me to stand out in the rain with a microphone, I am all for it. <laughs> I mean, there are worse jobs. I've had worse jobs. Yeah, uh, like armpit smeller. That is a real job. <laughs> you think I'm joking? Look no. I know you're not joking. Oh. Just out of curiosity. What's my island level at? Three. Okay. Oh no, man. I mean, it seems Peace Lord, how's the uh, workouts been going? Oh yeah, that's right. You have been getting back into weightlifting, haven't you? That is uh I need to do the same. I was not toting around an extra 200 pounds. I know his beards look like it's been uh, been working out. <laughs> He's got that strong beard going. Do you have to say it in such a strange way? Yes, he's contractually obligated. Okay. What? Why is my cobblestone <laughs> just floating down the... No, come back. Floating down the river? I'm just floating down my, my little water spout thingy. Come back. <laughs> there it is. Come in, come in. Nope, nope. I, I will. There we go. Probably should be a little more careful about grabbing cobblestone like that. There's no shelter over there. Ah, it's definitely doing something, Beast, man. I, I could tell just in your face, dude. Alright, I know I really need the cobble, but just so I can have accomplished something. Yay! And completing the quest gives me regen for a little bit, which I really need to. Um, the way Minecraft works, when lava flows into running water or waterlogged block, it creates cobblestone. Th this is supposed to be part of how different elements of the, the world naturally interact with each other uh, for other aspects. So if you know the way the game works, you can take advantage of it with mechanics like this where you have a lava flow set near a flowing water source. And then you just kind of, you know, uh, it, take advantage of game mechanics. That's the nice way of saying it. I, I'm pretty sure there's another way of saying it, but we'll go with, we'll go with that way. <laughs> um, later on, much later on, when we get tool uh, pickaxes with silk touch, you can set it up so that way if the lava runs underneath the flowing water it generates smooth stone instead of cobblestone which is a better building block for a variety of reasons let me put that away before I lose it alright I need I don't know. Uh, ooh, would that be alchemy? I mean, we are transmuting things. Or it's not wizard. 
It's not conjuration. Although if I step out from under this cover, I am about to summon some uh, <laughs> phantoms. Uh, Minecraft has a mechanic where if you don't sleep for a certain number of days in a row, when you step out under the open sky at night, these uh, phantoms will appear and attack you. And when there's nothing off the edge of your island but a deep void of sadness and death, uh, you really don't want to <laughs> fall off the edge of your island. <laughs> I'm hoping to get enough of these to put some safety rails around my island. No. What was that? Oh. He's just demonstrating for everyone. Oh. I lost another dirt. Me too, <laughs> I lost two. I can't afford to keep losing dirt. Well, uh, you can get dirt back as some of the mission rewards. Oh, stop with the mission rewards. <laughs> or sorry, the, uh, the challenge rewards. I keep saying missions. I don't know why I keep saying missions. They're challenges. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so instead of playing vanilla Minecraft, we're playing Skyblock, which is you s we each have our own little island in the sky. And uh, it's our job to, to level it up by adding more blocks using cobblestone generators like this. There's challenges. Um, so, like, there's a challenge for mining 64 cobblestone. Uh, I know that says 66, but that's because I already uh, finished it once. You can finish it a second time, but it takes 66 cobblestone. And it keeps going on and on and on like that. And... and uh, where is it? Yeah, so like the apple collector, if I can ever get a tree to grow, when I chop it down, it has a chance of dropping apples for other people. Not for me. My, my dice hate me. But in the eventuality that I can get two apples, I can get one of each type of sapling and four of dark oak, which would be awesome. Uh, cause I really, really prefer working with spruce. It's a little more efficient. Um, <laughs> But if I can get, like, the, the melon farmer, then that reward is eight dirt, which is great, because there's no way to generate dirt. <gasps> you can't take advantage of mechanics tricks like that to generate dirt. It just, it just is. Oh, speaking of trees. Hello. Oh, good. You actually gave me another... Oh, you know what I don't have? I don't have an axe. And I need more lumber to make an axe. Punching the tree it is. A melon slices. One shot. Oh wait, no. That's a lemon slice, not a melon slice. Alright. Uh, so you use a log to make planks. Planks to make a stick. Do I need a furnace? Everybody needs a furnace. One of those. I should probably put my bucket somewhere safe too. Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Come on, apples. Sadness. Alright, uh, let me get. Nope. Let me get some charcoal cooking. Which is you can burn stairs with oak planks. No. Huh? No. You want to burn the log, log to get the... Hey! Hello, food. I missed you so. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Only in a video game do you... Do you yeah. Are you sitting there going, Ooh, dirt! <laughs> yeah. 
it, it's always funny the way some of that some of that works out. Put the walls away. I kind of wish that the game had a way to uh, better manage your inventory. Like if there was a way to make a, a bag or a sack that let you, uh, you know, bundle your stuff together. <laughs> you know, like maybe doing a bundle out of, oh, I don't know, rabbit hide or something. That'd yeah. Be, that'd be awesome. Although, uh, even joking about that, <laughs> we are a little early game for uh, for that. With the version of Skyblock that we're playing, when you level up your island, you'll have the ability to change the biome. And it does... Uh, different biomes have uh, different features. So you could set an area... And you don't, it doesn't have to be the whole island. It can be just a part of your island. So if you set a part of your island as a desert, it has a chance to spawn rabbits. From which you can get leather and food. And, uh, you know, various other... There, there's different biomes that give you different things. Like, there, you can set an area as an ocean biome. Uh, which will which will let you get a better selection of fish and squid and stuff. Trying to get one more tree going while I'm waiting. Um, I'm trying to actually lay out my island this time. When we did the test, mine looked like... Uh, oh, uh, One Wing and Angel. We're, I, I'm being a little sarcastic. Mo, uh, Moyang, the company that makes Minecraft, is working on an addition in the Caves and Cliffs update called Bundles that they postponed the release of. So, the, yes, there are bundles. They, they are a thing that can help you uh, manage your inventory. We just don't have them yet. Two, three... And I'm still a little salty about the fact that they put those off. Um, don't worry, the rabbits don't make it easy. But by the time you go to get the rabbit, you, you're you're ready to uh, to end him. <laughs> uh, for lighting for the between the tree space, is it six mm -hmm. between each tree or five between each tree? Uh, depends on the tree. I've been putting. Okay. Four uh, a four block perimeter around each tree. I'm probably spacing it out more than I have to, but I'm also going to build a different style tree farm as soon as I get the resources. Gotcha. <laughs> I think we worked for that place. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Took me a second. Just a second, though. Just, just a second. One second. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, and, and I, I think, unfortunately, we're not, we're not able to play with some of the features that are in the most current release because the the group that has that uh, built U Skyblock um, hasn't updated it yet. Yeah, we we got stories, but we can't tell them all on air. Or many of them, or even the plurality of them. Fire's hot. Yes, the yourself. hot fire is hot. Hmm? I can share lots of my stories. You can. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I need... 
good. Ow. Okay. This is hurt. I need to move some stuff around. Generally speaking, yes. <laughs> this my pinky already hurts from shifting so much yes it does take a lot of creative wording maybe that was a bad place to put the cactus I'm going to have to rethink that. Yeah, th there's been a lot of that going on. And this time I'm actually trying to think it out and plan ahead. When we ran the test, I, I just, you know, like, ooh, let me check how this works out. So my island ended up looking like a bad MC Escher painting. And uh, it, it wasn't exactly what one would call organized. Because it was mostly just like, ooh, how's that work? Huh. And you can do this, and you can do this, and I can do this. Mm -hmm. Well, I think I'm officially past the time that I spent on the last one, on the <laughs> test realm. Why do you say that? Because I didn't play on that very long. Right. Yay, more couples. can't get me now. What can't get you right now? Do the night. Phantoms cannot get me now. Oh. Uh. Okay. Here's a chance to show off a little bit of what we can do, too. <gasps> so, we can use the island command to warp to other people's islands? Uh, don't you have to set that up? Uh, you have to enable it for each island. Yeah, I forgot to do that, so let me go do that. Uh, <laughs> uh the warp oh, is uh, this, not this, the warp is not a part of mine uh vanilla Minecraft. It is part of the Skyblock experience. I I just Oh look, there's your lunch traveling down the uh the waterway. Hmm, okay. You might not want to stand there. Okay. I, I might not <laughs> stand at a lot of places here yet. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Uh, let me, uh... <laughs> Warning! An on-junior is warping to an on-junior's island. Yes! <laughs> it's because I didn't use the home command. And night's coming. Time to hide from the phantoms. I hear they have a really good opera, though. Mm. Oh, that was bad. A little overplayed. Yeah. Mm. Uh, yes, there is some parkour involved. Uh, some islands more so than others. Hey, hey, hey. I felt like that was pointed, sir. Uh, that was not pointed. Nah, he just visited mine. Yeah. <laughs> And there are some some terrain difficulties right now. Yeah. Yeah, I, I what I wanna do is I wanna get this part of the island a nice square of all the dirt from the starter island. I'm gonna get some tree farms off that side. I'm gonna build a house with a work area off another side um, as soon as I get a little bit further oh, no, that's not what I wanted um, as soon as I get up to level yeah I know that Anon Jr. is a shifty character I am literally just standing down here at the bottom of the world. Mm -hmm. And I'm getting fish, black ink, and... Uh, oh, down the, down the water stream? 
I'm at the bottom and I'm level, I'm making the platform wider. And as I'm standing here, they're just falling on top of me. And yeah. Running. Yeah. <laughs> See, I, I, I told you, you guys are already down there and everything. I, heck, I haven't even finished growing. Like, I haven't grown a pumpkin yet. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've grown uh, a pumpkin. A pumpkin. A singular pumpkin. I haven't even planted pumpkins and stuff yet because that costs like, you know, wood to make a uh, which one to make a hoe. Yeah. That. Yeah. Well, you know what, Scott Skylord is is in my future. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Since since you guys came in a little late, uh, so we're playing with a pl- uh, plugin called Custom Origin. And it takes your standard cobblestone generator and it allows you to uh, level it up as you level your island up. So right now everybody's island starts at beginner. So level one through... Oh, <laughs> no, 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 that's not... <laughs> I love it though. Okay. Um, so everybody starts at beginner. You, everybody's island started at level 1.4 or something because you get so many points per each block and everybody's island starts the same. Uh, so if you drop down below level 1, it's because you lost stuff. Once you get up to level 20, you can unlock the novice builder, which also unlocks the novice cobblestone generator, which means you start getting a percentage chance to generate some of the extra blocks that we you would normally get through mining in vanilla Minecraft, but you don't have easy access to during Skyblock. So uh, once you hit island level 20, you got a 1% chance to get andesite. You got a 1% chance to get diorite. You got a 1% chance to get granite. Uh, you got a 0.25% chance to get clay, and so on and so forth. And then you notice the next level up is adept, the next level up is expert, and your percentage chance of the different ores and whatnot goes up as you level up. The top level is Skylord. And uh, the names and, and level numbers were chosen because... In, in your challenges, that's the level that it goes at. You start at beginner, and you got to finish all these novice challenges. And the last one is novice builder, reaching level 20. And then the next one is adept, which comes at level 50. And the next one is expert. The next one is master. The next one is skylord. The last page of challenges is kind of interesting. It's all world foods. Uh so, like, one of the challenges is to make fish and chips. you got to collect so many cod and so many baked potatoes in order to do the fish and chips challenge. <laughs> uh, there are a bunch of Dutch uh, recipes that I will not butcher the names of, out of respect. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure they're very tasty, though. They need to get, put in a challenge uh, to give you a, you know, the reward is a full set of fully enchanted tools. <laughs> and and, the, and you know, the, the challenge is to make a lossless cobblestone generator. Uh, oh, all you need is a hopper. Uh, salt on fish and chips? No, vinegar. Vinegar, vinegar. absolutely. But I'm also for originally from New England, so uh, the accent may have softened up over the years. I mean, we I'm moved this. New we moved the summer something. between my eighth and ninth grade year. What was that, medic? I said I'm not from New England, and I still say vinegar. Well, you're also from the part of North Carolina that prefers the vinegar-based uh, barbecue, right? Or no? Yeah, I keep getting absolutely. that mixed up. Absolutely. Absolutely mixed up, or I absolutely prefer the vinegar, the vinegar-based yeah, I barbecue. Prefer the vinegar. I prefer the vinegar-based. Maybe if I put that, it'll stop bouncing up over there. <laughs> Oh, 
the oh there we go and a little bit of light just in case what for vinegar no not for tasty value <laughs> fine oh medics med med just got a call I'll oh. be uh I'll, I'll be right back as soon as I'm done with this call. <laughs> okay. Get it, get, uh -oh. it, get, it, get it, get it, got a call. Yeah, no, no, we get it, we get uh, it. <laughs> oh, hey, uh, Anon, you should warp over to my island and not, show... Not, not, not at four, not four in the morning. I, I will happily warp over there at a safer time of day. Uh, you can show them my, my new skin. Yeah. Actually, you know what? Don't worry about it. Beast, in one way, you're going to have to check out my stream. Yes. See what my new skin looks like. There we go. Let's do that. <laughs> yeah, because yeah. you are going to start streaming more again, right? Yes, absolutely. As a matter of fact, I set my schedule up. Um, I will be streaming on Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. Nice. Um, Monday and Thursdays will be 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. Eastern Standard. And Tuesdays, I'm going from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m., and then we'll roll into the Anon Junior stream. So There we go. And One Wing and yep. Angel, here's the different recipes. There's fish and chips. Uh, Hut spot. Uh, brownies. <laughs> pasta. Pasta. Fun guy. Did you just say something Yiddish? <laughs> <laughs> Belgian chocolate and uh, patisserie. Rotisserie or patisserie? But... Patisserie. Yeah. I had a skeleton named that once. Yeah, yeah, that was in a D&D &D campaign. Oop, I should probably not walk into the lava. That would be bad. Everyone mispronounced it rotisserie, but yeah. you know. Well, we had fun with your character. Your character was adorable and naive. Well, uh, I mean. But uh, challenges or not, the game does have a recipe for cookies, which, while fun, do do not help you with the hunger very much. Oh, it's daylight. I mean, seriously, who has? <laughs> who has? Who has cocoa beans in this? I mean. I guess maybe you could get them from a trader. Yeah, geez. yeah. The wandering trader can send you. Uh, so can happily sell you a some cocoa beans. Once you have emeralds. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. That ain't happening anytime soon. Well, there, yeah, there is that because I don't think the the emeralds show up in the origin until level fifty. Hmm. Mm. Why we do that? Yeah, it is an eclectic buffet. I did not put that together. That is uh, the default uh, Skyblock challenge. For this go round, I left all the challenges pretty much as they were in the default Skyblock, uh, with two exceptions. Uh, there is a challenge in there for building an iron farm, except. Uh, whoever put you Skyblock together used a an incredibly old school definition of an iron farm, so I changed that to something a little bit closer to the the contemporary iron farms. And there's another one where the reward is an ocelot, which used to be the only way you could get a cat is to tame an ocelot. Uh, that is no longer the way to get a cat, so. The reward now gives you a cat, if you want one. I don't know why you would, but if you want one. Company, it gets lonely on this little island in the sky. Well, that and cat and cats do scare away creepers, and I think phantoms too. I can't remember if they scare yeah, away phantoms. Yeah, I can't remember if they. I couldn't remember if they scared away the cat. Uh, the, the scared away the cats. Scared away the phantoms, or just killed them outright because cats are nature's cutest predator. No, they repel them. Okay. Like, the things will still try to dive at you, and once they hit, like, a three-block sphere around a cat, they, like, eat, change direction. <laughs> so I need cats. Yeah. Yeah, you're going to need a lot of cats. Is that what I'm hearing? <laughs> That's what you're hearing. <laughs> oh, 
something, something, something. Rest is now a cat lady for the season. What? Uh, um, to be honest, at work, like that's already kind of like I'm not a cat lady, but like we have a symbiotic relationship. <laughs> yeah, the cat, the cats kill all the things that you don't like hanging around the workyard, and uh, you know, and I feed them. <laughs> I gotta start thinking about better ways to go about this. Uh, hmm. Alright, let me build up. Yeah, one wing cats are not like naturally my favorite thing on the planet. <laughs> they are not a few of her favorite things. But the ones at work, we have a uh, yard for the construction company that I do office stuff for, and they keep the creatures that I would rather not deal with away. <laughs> that's, that's a wonderful way to put <laughs> that. I told you the poor people at work got to uh, see my instinctive reaction to... Oh, to bugs? Uh, yeah. Creepy crawlies, yep. Yeah, they were not prepared. Oh. Uh. Especially given the way that you've manhandled some of the personnel. People are easier to deal with than bugs. <laughs> I I don't even know what to say about that, so I'm, I'm just going to quietly chuckle to myself and, uh... I'm not wrong. If I put you... Is there stuff under there? Nope, there's no there under there. Okay, so if I do... Yeah, we need to... I, it's been on my to-do roster, but I've been having trouble getting stuff done on my to-do roster uh, to get Java as an emote. Of course, Java the cutest emote. does not cooperate with photo shoots at all, to the frustration of all parties involved. He's a little diva. A little. All right. Um, how do I want to do this? I would like to make this out of lumber if a tree would grow. Oh, if only a tree would grow. Oh, the places we would go. Oh, wait, no. That's something different. Oh, tree. Oh, hush. Hey. <laughs> I got three stupid little saplings sitting out here doing nothing. I still have only had one sapling at a time. Really? That's... Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's not good. Aww. That one only gave me two <laughs> saplings. <laughs> <Thank> um. <you. laughs> yes, Jabba absolutely loves carrots, but the problem is he doesn't cooperate in the way you want him to for those. He is rather a different sort of special for those. Special's a really nice way to put that. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to be really nice about it. He's adorably cantankerous. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's just adorable. And no. <laughs> no. <laughs> wow. Did you hear that, Jumbo? Somebody called you cute, and Mama goes, "No." Hey, he's my baby. I can say whatever I want. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this to work. Where's my bucket? Oh, let's not fall through the floor. Thank you very much. Jump. Um. Oh! 
no, why not? No, first is a great word. No. Did I lose? No, okay. I got the wheat seeds. Cantankerous is a fun word. Dubious. Dubious is a good word. Indubitably. Indubitably is an amazing word. I love the way that word sounds. Indubitably. You think you're funny. I feel like I should be singing here. Uh, Poppins or something. Wow. None of those are Mary Poppins words. No, just the way you're rattling off these like five dollar, six dollar words. I'm like, I don't. No. Why? Why are you not working like you should? Hello, Pink. How are you? Is that the problem? Pink Geek. Do I need a floor under there? Yes, yes you do. I mean, I actually don't know what you're talking about. I'm doing something else. Uh, my infinite water supply is no, not infinite. Problematic. Yeah, it's slightly problematic, especially when I need to to make a new one. Hello, Pink Geek. Sorry, late to the party. Slightly distracted. Okay. Now it worked. Yay, tree! Oh! Oh, hey! I get a tree too! Hot diggity. I get two trees. Uh -oh. One tree, two tree. Red tree, blue tree. Oh, that would only give me two saplings too. Hello, pink. Pinky, have you played any Skyblock before? Are you familiar with Skyblock? Uh, <laughs> yeah, we will have to find a place to uh, to find a a beach duck. I don't know, I'm not gonna have enough sand anytime soon to make a beach duck. Mm -mm. Oh, I'm not gonna have enough sand to make a beach anytime soon. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, you see that little island under there? We all started with an island like that and a chest full of starter supplies. And it's our job to build from there. And right now it's my job to hide from the phantoms because I just realized it was about to be night. Uh... What do I want to do? I want to... Start moving storage down this way. And apparently... Yeah, uh, it's not the, the big island there. It's the little one underneath it. That's what you start with. That, that little, little tiny island over there. And uh, we're, we're all building and growing, and I, I have Rayest is making a hot mess of cobblestone over there. I'm trying to figure out why. <laughs> that should be our recruitment what? criteria. <laughs> you, you have to do a skyblock season with us before we'll let you into a real season. <laughs> If I can make the cut on Skyblock, then anybody can make the cut on Skyblock. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's not that bad. Oh, let's try not falling through the hole. Because uh, the good thing is that I'm learning quite a bit. So when season three starts, I'll be a lot better than I was in season one. Yeah. One Winning Angel, it has nothing to do with confidence, uh, <laughs> and it has everything to do with there's nothing but a deep void of sadness. Basically, uh, that level there where you see Arcadius building his floor, 
that is the lowest possible place you can place a block. When you fall below that, you die. Can you actually see it from way up here? Yeah, you can. Yeah. Okay, who is... I think that's you. I think I'm down there. I don't know. Well, because... Can you see me from where you are? I think you're on the other side of the world, aren't you? I, I cannot no. see you, but I can see your stuff. And that is definitely gotcha. you. That, that's an Arcadius build if I ever saw one. Hey, yep. hey, hey, wait a minute. Hold up. What do you mean, wait a minute? Yep. <laughs> that's supposed to mean. What do you mean, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> I have not fallen once yet, but uh, now that you... Why, why would you jinx me like that? <laughs> I don't know, but it's kind of funny. No. No. <laughs> uh, the for fun part is because none of us have fallen yet and no one wants to be number one. Yeah. None of us have a problem being number two. Why? <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, don't do it. Don't do it. No, don't do it. Let it happen organically. Let us learn who is the true Let, first let's ha let's have a of the season. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have a natural <laughs> organic death, not a fake death. Exactly. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> that one doesn't count. One doesn't it only counts count. as one. Oh, wait. No. Wrong property. They're kind of litigious, too. Litigious. Get out of here. No, no. Well, I mean, they are. Return home. There we go. Uh, I need your food anyway, so... Yeah, it, it's not a superstitious thing. <laughs> it, <laughs> also, how do you think most science started? Someone did a weird superstitious thing, and someone said, that's not true, let me prove you wrong. <laughs> and a thus sufficiently, science. Sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. That's all I'm going to say. Oh, don't get him started on this topic. Oh, no. It's not good for anyone. There we go. Now I got my infinite water source. Because in Minecraft, when you have two water sources separated by a blank space, space, goodness, space. I love the spaces. Words. Words. How do they work? They're hard. Um. Anyway, your blank spaces. It, it will actually <laughs> create a water source between them. So, uh, you start off skyblock with only two pieces of an ice that melt into water. So by making one source over there, one source over here, it filled in the middle, which means I can pull water from the middle source all the time. And not and it will constantly regenerate that middle one. Uh, it is another case of playing to the various mechanics of uh, Minecraft. This is uh, this is definitely a, a season where we're all going to brush up on our mechanics and uh, get, learn a lot more than what we knew before. Because it's going to be a lot of no 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 no. Oh, what, what's I the stood name? outside. Oh, 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 that no. Uh, are are you are you uh, being visited by the Phantoms Three? Yeah. Better than five. Uh, I could have installed the bigger Phantoms data back. Please don't do that. No. That's not funny. It'd be funny at least once. Until I step out from undercover. <laughs> then it would be... <laughs> do you know how long it's going to be before we get a sheep? One wing. <laughs> yeah. Science! Level is my island. <sighs> Five. Okay. And I'm currently rank two. I'm gonna have to get cracking on that. Who's got one? I was you know actually who's... curious who's got one at this point. Yeah. You know who's got <laughs> one. Who? 
You? Me? You? How do you test that? Hold on. <laughs> Slash <laughs> island info. Yes, you are currently at level 5.18. Which you? Uh, because uh, Arcadius. Because he has 235 cobblestone slabs, which count as 2.35 for the score. It says I'm rank 3. Is it backwards? Uh, okay, then let's check Rayest. Oh, Rayest is the one who's at level 18. Because what? <laughs> what? <laughs> because she has... 1,581 cobblestone. <laughs> Dang. For a total of 15.81 points. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> Thanks, hon, for being so confident in my abilities. <laughs> well, I mean, I expect this sort of thing, oh. like, you know, next week. Not, not right now. Oh, oh, that's beautiful. I love it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh. What okay. about my cobble mess? It's still a hot... Look, look, you were giving me trouble for my MC Escher-inspired island, and, and you got you got that funky for, cobble formation. I thought you were building a block. I thought this was going to be neat and pretty. I'm trying to, <laughs> but then things happened, and I don't understand how water works. So <laughs> this is what we have. <laughs> First, I'm working on it. Bad things happened, and then more bad thing. This, oh, this is what I hear Reyes okay. doing every time she starts up Conan. Uh, <laughs> Only one sapling. It's okay. The server we play on, the message has been changed to first dot dot dot. They did bad things. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I need to move the sign again. Yeah. Uh, Skyblock has the ability to. Uh, inspect the text that's on signs so that way you can right click it and do various fun stuff yeah yeah exactly it's that scientific method we were talking about uh all right that's right i wanted to move the infinite water supply down there because i'm gonna tear this all up temporarily but first, You're I can do bad things. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for it. <laughs> I can never say that without thinking of uh, Justin Robert Young's politics, 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 because he goes and you know to to his spiel, and then always goes. But first. I need. All right, that's the center okay, of that my. That tree is island. more lit than anything on my island. Why is it not growing? Light is only part of the equation. Yeah, light is part of the equation, as is space. The final frontier. It, it has Needs all the, the space on the planet. Um, give me two seconds. Oh, never mind. You have nothing over it. Uh, well, because I, I saw your little shelter there, and I thought that might have been too close, but that's not it. Um, mm -hmm. no, your tree's just being a jerk. Okay. <laughs> there, there, there's nothing anywhere remotely close enough that should be causing that kind of trouble. I just got a tree. I just got a tree. Am I really who you want to be mean to? Nope. Okay. Actually, I don't like. I, I need to. I need to. Sword, 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 sword. You die! Yay! <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Uh, doggone it! I lost track of what I was gonna do. Um. 
bad things. All right. I've got a pumpkin so I can get more seeds. I've got a couple melon slices so I can get more seeds. Get a tree. Oh, I was going to say, if it gave me no saplings, I was going to be mad. There we go. Um, I am so absent-minded. Was I getting ready to... Do? You know what? I, it doesn't give me a stupid apple yet, has it? No. No, it hasn't. <laughs> I know how that goes. I don't even have a tree, so I'm going to need you to chill on the accusations at the islands. For now, let's do if I can get these guys growing under here. That should be dark enough. At least until I can get something better set up. I, I really want to get my platform down to the bottom of the world, but I need more lumber for ladders. Oh, no. All right. <laughs> Take Dangerous. it easy, one winning angel. Good night. Yeah. Finish that workout. See you, one wing. Peace out. All right. I need... Ooh. Speaking of needing more lumber, hello. This gets a lot easier once you get spruce. But in order to get spruce saplings, I need to complete the quest to tur that uh, requires two apples to complete. Two apples. Uh -huh. You know, those things that aren't falling from the oak trees. Oh, I could have finished. I thought it was three apples. <laughs> uh, it's three apples the second time. It's two apples the first time. Oh, man. And okay. you can just hush with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, jerked trees was not in the meal challenge. I don't know. That sounds... I mean, maybe not. I, mean, I, I don't know. I like some jerk chicken. <laughs> jerk goat. Some tasty stuff, huh? Now I'm hungry again. You ain't lying. I think it was the coffee. Of course, I, <laughs> it didn't help that I was listening to Daily Tech News Show and Sarah Lane was talking about stopping by some bakery that apparently they all know where she went to get a sticky bun. And apparently this place does not serve small sticky buns. Like, these are the ridiculously large sticky buns of you ain't going to finish that alone. Except <laughs> she went and finished it alone. Wow. Um, and she goes, yeah, I, I reached that point where I'd eaten so much I felt really bad. And then I figured, well, I mean, I already feel bad. And it's really tasty. And they're less good reheated. So I finished the rest. Oh, I know that life. <laughs> I, I thought you might. <laughs> like, I mean... I, could, I couldn't I could even be mad. There, there's not... Nah. There, there's nothing to be mad about. <laughs> Alright. 
because what I want, what I want to do is I want to get a a pillar like that. Well, maybe neater than that. Uh, down to the down to the lowest level, like where Arcadius has going there. But unlike the island during the test, I want it running right down the center of the island. Yeah, right here. But I'm kind of running short on space. Final frontier. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I keep trying to watch that show, and it keeps not going well. Uh, which, which one? The Next Generation, or... Yeah, like season one is just. So oh no no no! Se bad. Season one is rough. Like like season one, there were some cast problems, there were some crew problems, there were some writer problems. Uh, if you can get through season one, it really picks up uh, about halfway through season two. But to get the foundation of some of the personalities involved, you get you got to kind of and some recurring characters, you've got to kind of slog a little bit through season. The sadness of season one. Make me sad. <laughs> oh, trust me, season one made all of us sad. Oh, and, and for those not familiar with Minecraft, your your basic unit is a block. Slabs are half a block, and that means that there is a bottom slab, where it's the bottom half of the block, and a top slab, where it's the top half of the block. When your floor is bottom slabs, uh, the things that will eat your face when you're not looking, and even when you are, uh, cannot spawn on bottom <laughs> slabs. Uh, which is why my entire floor is inconveniently bottom slabs. I don't like it, but I also don't like skeletons and zombies and things randomly spawning and making my life very, very sad. Uh, I would love to have skeletons and zombies and things spawning on mine. Why? For the bones? That's, that's free loot, man. <laughs> Show off. You're just really mad that I'm beating you, aren't you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? No, not really. Really? I'm proud of oh. you. I'm proud of you. Mm -hmm. yeah. Thank you for that. I need to move my lava, my, my lava, my cobblestone generator under here where it's a little less awkward. So here's what I want to do. Oh, nighttime, nighttime, nighttime. Mm -hmm. There's no <laughs> sleepy yet, because hey, none of us got a bed to sleep in. Probably do that. What, make a bed? No, make the mob grinder so I can get the string to make a bed. Uh, oh, trust package. me, that that is also on, on my uh, list. Um... Alright, so if the water starts there. Um, oh, that's right. That's where all my stairs went. So the water source starts there, flows down. No. I need it over and down. It's going to go across and down. The lava source will go over. And then I just need to uh, 
That's where the water source is going to go. That's where the lava is going to go. Let me get some trapdoors. Because that'll hold it in and be cheaper. flow down the lava will come across that's still not uh, the final cobble generator design I just need to get it a little bit better than it is I'll put that oh my goodness come on I haven't gotten a single apple yet either yeah yeah, I, I, the 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 trees are being jerks about that. Mm. For some reason, the one time I don't want to jump over, there we How go. far away are we from Redstone? <laughs> You're funny. What? This wrong. Please be right. Please be right. Um. I was just thinking if a piston didn't require redstone. Oh. <laughs> then you could take the piston and just shove the dirt down. Or shove the um stone down. Oh doggone it. Not only did I math that out wrong, but now I got uh, an obsidian block that it won't let me change back. Hmm. How'd you end up with that? Uh, spacing. Oh. You can't change it back? Nope. How are you going to get lava? Uh... Slash reset? Not slash reset. I, I will... I will do add many things to fix that because okay. uh just like i would do for you guys because that's that that's not yeah, your fault that stinks. That. Nope. That, that, that's a game ender yeah yeah i i wouldn't i'm i mean but i'm not that mean hush 
I said I was nothing. agreeing, dude. That that's horrible. I remember getting some uh, obsidian. Oh, there we go. Our test oh, run. good, 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 good. It converted back. Thank you. Ooh. All right. Um. That also gives me light. Don't need that one there. There we go. Okay. So now I can just it's do that. Day. This is water flowing down. The same basic idea, cobble generator, except for whatever reason, uh, the custom origin doesn't recognize the type of cobble generator that I was using even though what I was using is a lot more space efficient than what they prefer. Um, but it recognizes that one? But it recognizes as long as the water is flowing down at least one block. Hello, beach duck. As long as the water is flowing down at least one block, that is what it recognizes. Hmm. Which is... Weird. I was going to go special. Special was the the word I was thinking of. I'm going with weird. Uh... No, the water is not flowing up. It's flowing down. I guess I technically don't need... I don't need those on this side. Mm. Yeah, too bad this is a 1.17. We get some dripstone and make a lava generator. Uh, yes. Don't don't think I wasn't thinking about that. And on the one hand, I. Uh oh. <laughs> I hear a puppy about to get fed. That's why I had that there. Okay. Um, uh, on, on the one hand, there is a 1.17 version of Spigot. Unfortunately, U Skyblock does not support it yet. There's some workarounds to get it to, to work anyway, but they are super glitchy. So I got a cobble generator that works there. Uh, I was hoping these guys would grow, but is the light level too too high? Uh, client light seven. Oh, <laughs> that. Hmm. Uh oh, uh, that's a bad idea right there. Cause that's a light level. Uh, that's a light level nope. All right, maybe I'll try the mushroom farm later when I can get some podzel. Cause some mushroom soup would be really good for the food situation right about now. Stairwell. Same I am. Alright. I don't need that stuff there now. Because my cobblestone generator has moved. I don't need that. Because I've moved my cobble generator. I 
finally got more than one sapling. Nice. Hmm. Look at two trees. My life is significantly happier now. <laughs> Alright. Rip up the stuff that I had there for the cobble generator. We can get a little, uh, a little dirt. Matter of fact, I can do that right there. All right, so. Let me put anything I don't absolutely need in storage, just in case the unfortunate happens. Um, storage. Haha. <laughs> Your storage box. Singular. Yeah. Why, no, this is not organized. Why would you ask? <laughs> All right. My lone bucket. I'll be a lot happier once I get some more iron. That's for sure. Get some more charcoal. Hey! Oh, okay. That's fair enough. Mostly you're missing me rambling to myself anyway. <laughs> As I sit here and try to remember all the intricacies of, alright, if this does this and that does that, then... Yay, Apple! Oh, uh, you suck. Yeah, uh, the random numbers are... Like, I, I have a tough time with random numbers on the first place. Ask anybody who plays D&D &D with me. But, like... Minecraft is being unusually horrible to me about random numbers. <laughs> the, the troublesome trees are still troublesome. Ooh, tree! Ooh, two apples! Oh, hush. Pumpkin! Pumpkin! No. Hush. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yay. I'm going to try to get a little more light over there in just a minute. All right. Uh, wow, look at all the saplings. Let me pull that out like a so. And since I got a, I got a half slab under there, so I don't have to worry about that. We'll do that, which means I can now take the torch there, put it in the middle. Oh. Yeah, I know my kingdom for some spruce. Oh. All right, I need. Yeah slabs will be fine. Okay, finally got enough trees to Almost. actually start replenishing themselves at a decent rate. Yeah. Still no apples, though. Uh, I have... Day 36, apple no apples in sight. <laughs> I have one apple if anybody needs one to complete your quest. I don't have the second one. Otherwise, I would totally take you up on that. Thank you, though. <laughs> what was it you needed? 
I got no apple. Hey, my Are you name supposed is apple. to burn oak planks to get more charcoal or oak logs? Oak logs are the thing you cook. You can use oak planks to cook them if that's all you've got. However, no, comma, I've got a I, yeah, I was getting ready to say I, I'd not do that. No, I got some charcoal. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, not that kind of apple. And oddly enough, the the actual fruit involved was not specified. It's only it's only because somebody said apple that uh we end up thinking that it was an apple. Of course, I spent too much time on the debate team because every time I hear Apple, I start thinking, A, my name is Alice, and I don't know why. Because it has that same cadence to the word. Oh, I need blocks. Wait a second, how, how wide is this? One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect. Yes, perfect. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Eh, close enough. <laughs> uh, oh. How do I want to do this? That's, that's a big tree. You know what? No, I'll build, I'll build mm. the mushroom farm out this way. So I'm gonna need space. One. Oh. Okay, I oh. now have like. <laughs> a lot more apples if you need them raised. Oh, I'll totally take those. Yeah, Un unfortunately, or fortunately or unfortunately, it just says fruit. And a lot of people simply assumed apple. Or said right, apple, so be probably because some annoying kid... Sunday school kept asking, but what kind of fruit? So if I warped to to her place mm -hmm. and just drop two apples on the ground, she'll be able to pick them up, correct? Um, I think so. Okay. Let's I, I believe you're contractually to obligated to to make piglin noises like you're uh, trading. <laughs> is, this, is this a piglin bartering going on over here? Yeah, exactly. Uh, no. Nobody's catching up in the cobblestone race. All right, so I, I was so happy so that I, I had the nine dirt to make a mushroom farm, and then I realized it's supposed to be a nine by nine block. Um. So how do I warp to her location? Oh, you might want to wait. It's about to be nighttime, and my island is the least safe. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is the least safe of all islands. Actually, thank you for reminding me. I don't Let know. me uh, mine's, mine's pretty unsafe. Let me change the warp location to be down here where it's safe. And the home location. The current location is totally a safe home location. Come on now. Why are you doing that to me? <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's supposed to be a 9x9 nine nine block of dirt and I got the 9 dirt. Uh I mean, I could, I could fill it in with cobble and just sub in dirt as I earn more, but I gotta actually start earning more, which means I gotta start actually getting a little more uh, active in the in in the resource gathering. Although, with it being night, I, I'm a little short on things I can do down here. So I guess it's back to the cobble mines I go. With this, though, I left myself space that when I get enough iron, I can put a uh, hopper under here, which will help catch a lot more of the cobblestone and keep it from getting uh, 
eaten up with lava by the lava. Like it is right now. <laughs> do I risk it? Do I risk it? Do I risk it? I do risk it because I want pumpkins to grow. <laughs> oh, you're risking the phantoms for pumpkins? Yep. Well, I mean, I I just need a chicken. Because I got the pumpkins. I got sugar cane. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> that that is the sound of that was a poor risk calculation. <laughs> no, that that was that was I got right to the edge and my controller was like, oh, I want to keep going for you. No. <laughs> Did you say auto run? I heard auto run. Let's uh, auto run. Exactly yeah. what it was doing. Ah, uh, nope. <laughs> A fistful of nope and a few nope more. <laughs> Man. That gets the old <laughs> juices running. Awesome. Alright. Am, am I close to level 20? No. No, I'm at level 7. And I'm still ranked 2. You're at level 7? <laughs> yeah. There, there you go, mister. I was level 20 in 5 minutes. I didn't say five minutes, it was a day, but I also started building haphazardly. I, I'm trying to I actually like put a plan 1. here. 1.2 away. So, how do you figure out your island level again? When you right-click on your shiny thing, the little bottle that looks like enchanting stuff has your island, island level. You just hover over it and it says current level and how many points for eminals yep. and monsters and villagers and golems and hoppers and spawners and gale island levels by expanding your skyblock and completing certain challenges. Rare blocks will add more to mm -hmm. your level. Click here to refresh. Must be on your island. I, I should have also mentioned that uh, <gasps> way back at the beginning. I'm level 30! One of the things Sorry. that's going to make this challenge interesting is there's a cap to the number of animals, villagers, and so on that you can have. <gasps> you get diamonds? You got diamonds. I got a diamond. And I got five emeralds, and I got sand. What am I yep. doing wrong? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Get your own apples. Uh, in particular for me, you can only have a maximum of 50 hoppers. I like making machines and automating, and they tend to require a lot of hoppers. Like the mob grinder that I want to build is going to require nine hoppers. That's almost... <laughs> that's almost 20% of the allotment. <laughs> and 16 villagers? Who lives with a village of only 16 villagers? Come on. Medic, you gotta make the columns. I did make a column. No, no, no. no. She is making multiple columns. I'm not making a column. Um, I'm making a block. If you do oh. island slash island inspect... Uh, wait, no. Is it I slash island inspect, or is it just inspect? No. Oh, info. Sorry. Uh, slash is info and the name of the person to include yourself. It'll give you a scorecard report. So, like, slash is info. Exmetic frog says that your level is currently 6.27. You've got 375 cobblestone slabs. That's 3.75 points. You've got 167 cobblestone, which is 1.67 points. 25 cobblestone walls, which is 0.25 points. And so on and so on and so on. Uh, yes, you can have monsters. Matter of fact, one of your goals is to make a monster spawner. Like, you make a space where they intentionally spawn. And uh, and you can do that to get certain types of loot. Like if you want more bone meal to grow crops and things, you need skeletons because skeletons drop bones, which can be turned into bone meal. Uh, so this is this is part of where uh, more so than normal Minecraft, you really need to understand <laughs> uh, how mechanics of the game work. 
I, although I'm about ready to just start taking all this cobblestone and laying it all over the place because cobblestone is apparently a point of peace. And <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have the largest saucer of cobblestone. Oh, ever. yeah, I know. <laughs> Here I am trying to be all intentional and stuff. It, it, and we, we see where that's got me. I did better the last time. <laughs> oh, nah. Dude. We'll catch up to her sooner or later. Oh, no. Sooner. We will catch up sooner. <laughs> yeah, but remember, you guys also all play a lot more than I do. Thus my statement. We'll catch up sooner or later. <laughs> <laughs> I play maybe once a week. I need more torches. Call yourself a real gamer. I play this game maybe once a week. And yes, I call myself a real gamer because I can keep up with you and or beat you with only practicing once a week. Yeah, see, I, every day. Wow. I was trying not to go there. <laughs> uh, it's called skill. Is it early enough in the morning? Or n no, not yet. It's Don't play it. They can still spawn. They stop spawning at six. At six? Okay. At six. What time is it? Five forty. In game. <laughs> now, real life, we're having too much fun. It's like already nine o'clock. <laughs> is it nine o'clock already? Oh, it is nine o'clock yeah. already. Uh. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. It's amazing what happens when you're having fun. Yeah, I know. Zooms. So, how is it six now? Again? Huh? Yeah, it's six twelve. How do you warp again? Uh, slash is space warp, and then the name of the island that you're going to. Yeah, unfortunately, it's not one of the things that they put in the fancy menu. I really need to put put together a little cheat sheet cue card thing and send it to everybody. Hey, yes. Hey. Here. Ooh. Ooh, thank you. You're you want to see my side tower? Be very <laughs> careful because there's nothing over this edge. There's my side tower. Okay. Sad tower. Okay. Yeah, sad tower. I'm trying to make a foundation. Uh, did you know that they're getting ready to make a foundation TV series based off of the Isaac Asimov mm -hmm. books? I love the foundation series. I don't think I'm familiar with that one. The fa foundation series? Mm -mm. Oh, it's, it's amazing. Everyone keeps telling me I need to go listen to uh, Dune on... Yes, the, they're finally Audible. making progress on the movie again, which I have. I'm feeling very I ambivalent about. Had, I thought they already had a movie. The movie has been mm. in production, but because COVID, it's been uh, stalled. Wait. Well, at this point, it's despair. One wing, it started as hopes and dreams for a perfectly squareular tower, and oh, oh. I don't understand enough about Minecraft to understand why it's turned into the thing that it has. But ta-da, ta here we are. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, somebody thought they were going to make a solid block of cobble instead of trying to traverse water streams. Um, and, and 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 that happened. That, that, that is not a solid block of cobble, but I deeply suspect that it might be related to a uh, patience waiting for lava to fall. Actually, I think it's because I misplaced water one time and it created a lumpy thing. <laughs> is that the technical term? A lumpy thing? Yes. And... And then it just kind of got worse from there. And every time I try to fix it, it gets worse. <laughs> it gets a little more worse. Yeah. Did 
Yeah, no, that did nothing yeah, it productive, but it was fun. Sadder. All right. All right, the wheat has grown, so I can go ahead and harvest that. My pumpkin has grown, so I can harvest that. I need to temporarily pull up. Ooh, I got more seeds out of that than I put into it. Sweet. All right. I need a few things now. Before the end one. of the evening, I'm going to try to get one cobblestone column down to the bottom of the world. And I want to make sure that it is at the, uh, the center of the map. Or the center of my island. Which should be... Nope, over one. So that is the exact center of the island. Oh, no, uh, that this is just music I found in the YouTube creators library. That is my center. See if I can do this without screwing up my lava bucket. Let's also put the wheat seeds away, pumpkin seeds away, and the melon seeds away. Yeah, no, th this isn't the actual Minecraft music. It's just a mix of uh, stuff that I picked up out of the YouTube uh, Creators Library. I, I do tend to like blues and ja bluesy, jazzy kind of stuff. Although for, for the live streams, I did try to make sure that it was stuff that was a little more... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Fun? Yeah, fun. Upbeat, lively, young. Hey, seriously? <laughs> well. Ooh. What do you mean, well? <laughs> Ouch. All right. So, <laughs> up tempo. There we go. That works better. I like that better. You would. Effervescent. <laughs> Alright. So, what I am waiting is I am waiting for the lava to flow down to the bottom of the world. Lava is exceptionally slow, so this is going to take a little while. In the meantime, I'm kind of hoping a tree will grow. Alright, so that's going to be... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, corner. Sweet. 
Oh. Yay, green. No, not yay. Why not yay? Why yay? I mean, oh, all it does is all it does is make the void look even more dark and depressing and foreboding. Makes my <laughs> flowers grow. Doesn't make my trees grow. <laughs> if only. Oh. No. Oh. My spruce didn't drop a spruce. Sapling. Oh. Yeah. That's a shame. All right, that's not finished doing this thing. Oh, well, at least that tree grew. Oh, there you go, Rest. You got trees now. Mm-hmm. I should have finally got some. Just took a minute. Can you see them from ah, your place? No apples. Still no apples. Jerk. Uh, I have one apple. Nah. I'll get it. Yeah, I can see your place. <laughs> Dude, whoever lives next to me has an embarrassment of water coming out the bottom of their thing. <laughs> uh, that would most likely be Medic. <laughs> Leave my water alone. Just say it, man. It looks like you went to Taco Bell. Um. Oh, <laughs> <sighs> oh. No, 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 no. Oh, no. That was bad. That was bad. That was not fun. Still waiting on the water. Where's my water? And whatever happened to that game? That was a cute one. And it's night again. Mm hmm. Ooh, tree. Is it actually night? Yes. Yep. It is actually night. I cannot use my cobblestone generator because I'm waiting for the lava to fall into the end of the void. Is it still going? It's still going. Yeah, melon farming pays off, except right now I don't have any melons growing <laughs> anywhere because I had to temporarily uproot them. I also need to get the sugarcane cracking because that's one of the early... Actually, while I'm waiting for that, let me head over here. Uh, challenges. Yeah. The, the apple collector challenge is the one that I desperately would like to complete as early as possible because you get the different types of lumber. Uh, in particular, spruce farming nets you a ton of wood to work with really quickly and easily. And I need... Uh, to grow a 2x2 two two spruce tree to get Podzel, which will let me do the mushroom, uh, the shroom picker challenge when I get to the adept level challenges. Um, I would really like the sugarcane planter because that will at least give me four more dirt to go towards the 9x9 nine nine box I need for the shroom picker challenge. Uh... <laughs> Same for the melon farmer, but I can't do that until I get, uh, I mean, that's 128 melon slices. That's a lot of watermelon. Um, I'm not so worried about the cactus farmer. I mean, I, I eventually do want to get it because I'm a completionist. Uh, the pumpkin farmer is another one that I really would like to, to finish sooner rather than later because that's another eight dirt right there. 
Uh, although I gotta get enough pumpkins going to get 64 pumpkins quick enough. And I desperately want that stone brick maker because then I get some iron ore, which means I can make hoppers and redstone and I get a chicken, which means I can get eggs, which means that between the sugar and the melon, I can make pumpkin pies and I get a lot more reliable food than whenever, whenever a melon happens to decide to maybe pop out. <laughs> Actually, I gotta double check if that really is supposed to be 9x9. Nine nine. I'm having... I'm second guessing myself on that one. I'm pretty sure it was 9x9. Nine nine. Find out soon enough. I mean, I could probably put the sand and the cactus down. Because we're what? One, two, three. Yeah, so it wouldn't grow to its full height, but uh... I could still at least start farming it. Because cactus grows slow. Although, it's not going to have enough light down here anyway. Because I am unusually forgetful about lighting my build. That's not how you live long in Minecraft. No, I did not write the wiki for Minecraft. <laughs> uh, I, I do, I do try to understand the mechanics in no small part because it makes a lot of things easier. Is that still falling? Or did it finally hit the bottom of the void? Does the cobblestone not do the rappy thing here? The the what? Where it wraps around, like where it bends, where you got the little... Hmm? I want it to be like a little block on the top and like two, like... <sighs> Medic help. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not like fences? No, where a stair wraps around a thingy. Oh. Like it's in a corner. Yeah, you have to place it right. I've been placing it right. I got good at it last time. There we go. That's what I wanted. Yeah. Did you just hunt a monster? I did. Why? Because. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Because remember, flowing water running into lava creates cobblestone. And so I'm going to end up... Oh! Um, the dolphin just flew into the void. They do that. I'm Don't sure there's that. something very deeply philosophical about that, but I'm... <laughs> mm -hmm. Something to do with 42. Yeah. So long and thanks for the fish. Except there's only one fish in the water stream. How is it that other people seem to have, like... Uh, no, and there goes a squid. <laughs> All right. Oh. Okay. Let me pick that up. And put that back in its place. Yep. Let's put the bucket away, because until I get more iron, that's a, <laughs> that's a problem. Alright. I really need... Do I have enough lumber for ladders? Uh, I got one spare pick to use... You know what, let me put that one spare pick away. Just, you know, out of abundance of caution. You know what, I'll leave. <laughs> Considering... The part you're about to do is the part that I died like twice on during. Uh... <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Dur during our little test. test, yeah. Yeah. I don't know any better. I think you're about to try and get the uh, pillar up. Oh, I got the pillar. My problem is, 
I mean the like the ladder. Oh yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Of transport up and that, down that's use. that's a hundred and fifty blocks down, and I've only got thirty ladder. Um, math was never <laughs> my forte, but <laughs> I, I I think I I think I see a problem here. Nope, nope. That was probably a bad idea. It's dark out. Uh, <laughs> uh, bother. All right. Mind that cobble. Every day I'm cobble and cobble and cobble. Mm hmm. So I'm getting very unlucky with my tree growth this time, though. Last time, I at least got more apples. This time, my trees are jerks. <laughs> Splatting zone. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the nice thing is mine Minecraft physics are a little funny. If you fall into water of any depth... Even if it's like half a block of water, uh, you take no fall damage at all. Um, hey, can you look at your spawnery thing for me? Look at my what? What am I looking at? Um, where where your your lava creator or your cobble creator thing? Okay. Oh oh oh. It, are are you do it? Do I need to do this for you? Yes, please. You're gonna take a screenshot okay, now. So. <laughs> No, I was just gonna have you sit there. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna sit there. <laughs> All right, one of those. You know what you could do? You wow. could also Wait, warp crack, over. Crack. You can also warp over there and figure it out. No, look back, please, please, <laughs> please. You can also warp over there and figure it out. Is it morning yet? Close enough. Okay. Oh, cue the scary music. It's the Great Descent. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, let's not suffocate on our way down either, shall we? Sure. Yeah, I'm sure. Seventy three, seventy one. <laughs> Watching the, uh, watching those numbers. Oh, oh. Breathe. <sighs> yeah. Hang on. I, I gotta make sure that, uh, I stop this ride at zero. <laughs> Or at one, rather. Sorry, at one. Uh, if I stop it at zero, we've stopped too far. Almost. And there we go. That that is the lowest you can possibly build and not die. Let's uh, get us a nice little platform here. Oh, I should have brought the bucket so I could waterlog a slab under there. Oh well. Um. Well, bless you. Excuse me. Thank you. Yeah, I, I need to bring a bucket. 
but I also didn't want to bring a uh, a bucket all the way down here because that's that's how that's how you lose your one and only bucket. At least until I get more iron. I want fish, not not the not the dolphin. Oh, wait, what do you mean I can't harm that here? I can totally harm the fish. Watch me. <laughs> yes, that fish just fell into the void. Oblivion was such a good game. Don't worry, little fishy. I'll have your number in a minute, too. <laughs> oh, oh, I missed it. You and your little salmon, too. Oh, yeah. There we go. First fish. Of oh, hey. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I need more food. Got some apples you can have. Oh, hush. <laughs> That's all right. I'm going to get a little fish spawner going here in a minute, too. I just got to figure out where I'm going to put it. Oh, you're missing out one wing. Oh, yeah. Oblivion was, Oblivion was an amazing, amazing title in that genre. Awesome lore, awesome uh, quest lines. It, it was just a lot of fun. Although... When you go back, nostalgia was a little bit kinder on the graphics. Well, I mean, well, look, I mean, that, that, that's like when I did uh, Knights of the Old Republic and Knights of the Old Republic 2 for uh, Games Revisited. Yeah, it was a wonderful game. Uh, just, you know, uh, the graphics. It didn't, the, didn't the graphics didn't age earlier, as well I mean, as, uh, you know, one would hope. Oblivion turned like 13 today or something. All right, I need it's got to fall down a whole block, right? Uh, at a minimum. Okay. So it should really be more than a whole block. No. Uh, unlike in your world, there's nothing wrong with the bare minimum here. That seemed pointed. It was. Was it? Yeah. Hey! I, like certain people I have finally got an apple. Come on, apple number two. I mean, sheer statistics means I should get a second apple sometime soon. <sighs> I am some math major's PhD dissertation on <laughs> the stupidly unbelievable odds. Yeah. <laughs> How one man defied the odds and not in a good way. <laughs> Alright, the water will go in there and it will fall down here. Can you please look at it again while you're there? No, <clears throat> I need a campfire. <laughs> so I can cook my one fish. <laughs> This little fishy went to the market. Actually, no. I should probably do that down where I'm going to be. Over here. Alright, I'll cook that fish in a minute. I need to head down this way. Again. Without the suffocation. Ah, come on. I never thought I'd be fishing with an axe. Ah, come on. Oh! 
and he had bone meal. No. <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, that was almost bad. That was almost very, very bad. What was... Th oh, that was a dolphin dying on the floor. That... That's kind of sad. <laughs> okay. Yep, fishing vertically with an axe above a bottomless void. That's how we roll. <laughs> Not just any axe, a stone axe. Hey, oh. oh, good, I got the ink. Oh, no, 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 get back here. Oh, the poor dolphin. All right, now I gotta make my way back up there at least one more time. Oh no 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 no! Okay, okay. all right, because that's one of the things that I want to do is I want to fix it so that way the water column stays a column and doesn't flow over the edge. That way, when I ride the water column, I don't you know fall off and get pushed off into the void. Like, like that, like that. All right. Yeah, the the dolphin thing is kind of kind of messed up. Hmm. Oh, I think the fish head fell down below. Uh, there'll be more. We've got a data pack that uh, mobs like fish and cows and things have a percentage chance to drop a a player head. Actually, this reminds me. I probably ought to do the fish farm next. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> that was that was almost a very super unfortunate fall. Alright. So what I want to do here is I want the water to fall in just a single column all the way down to the bottom instead of that double wide like what we had before. So what I'm going to do is it's nighttime, so I'm going to go somewhere safe. <laughs> Somebody sleep. Uh, <laughs> Seriously. Well, I mean, you know, Reyes is already level, you know, 79, so... Oh, you should already have a bed. No, I can't figure out how to make the stupid generator that gets me the stuff that I need because somebody won't be kind and share knowledge. I've been very kind to share knowledge, and there's an example over on Spawn Island. It's not the same as what you did. Yeah, it is. It's exactly the same. Different. No, it. I. I promise you. It's okay, but from my understanding of it, mm -hmm. just show me the thing again. You're under there. I can take a picture with my phone. <laughs> <laughs> just warp <laughs> over to the island and take a look. It for you to be nice. Just warp over to the island and take a look. It's not even in a book. For serious. For serious. Sure. All right, that apple is very precious, so let me put that there. All right, what am I... I really didn't. I shouldn't have put that there. So I will instead put that. I can't because of the torch. There we go. And I'll tear that other one down in a minute. Mm, cooked cod. 
said no one. Um, uh, a lot, lot better than nothing. <laughs> well, lots of things are better than nothing. <laughs> That's right, I forgot about that. Ah, but that's still not efficient. Never mind. Alright. Uh, I need to I need to get that set up so that way the cod fall to the front. Um the graphics are intended to look from about the the Wolfenstein era. It is definitely supposed to be the 16-bit kind of feel to it. All right, let me let me put some stuff away. Yeah, I never played the uh, the PlayStation version of it, but uh. I I did have and I do still have Wolfenstein 3D. Alright. I need more trees. More trees. One more apple. I guess I ate the last of my melon or did I put it away? No, I ate the last of my melon. I gotta get some more of that cooking. Uh, I need to make a fish farm. Where do I wish for fish? All right, actually, if I build the fish farm off of this side here, then the water from the fish farm can hydrate the crops over here. There we go. Um, I built this floor a little bit lower than I really wanted to, though. Now that now that it comes down to it. Oh, dirt. That's what I was looking for. In memory. Uh, that is actually pretty close to what I'm going to do. What I'm going to do is I'm going to... Uh, water will stop flowing down when it runs into certain items. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a bunch of um, wooden uh, fence gates, which allow you to walk through, which allow stuff to fall through, except for water. And I'm going to put the fence gates up just high enough for me for me to be able to walk under the water and then just a tank of falling a tank of falling water and that way all I have to do is run around under there catching all the fish droppings that didn't sound right the dropped fish mm, yummy. Right, fish droppings I think I had that at the Chinese place Now, because I waterlogged a slab down there, that falling water is going to stop at the waterlogged slab instead of spreading out like it did before. Which means I don't have to worry about that pushing me off the platform. Uh, eventually, I will replace that with a ladder. But I've got 30 ladder to make 150. One ladder per block. It's 150 blocks down, and I've only got 30. I need more trees to grow. Nah, that's plenty of ladders. You'll be fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> At least I can start getting Let's a little... Skip the fish droppings. Yeah. Also, you need to pick better Chinese restaurants. I'm just throwing well, it out Well, I there. mean... Yeah, I need more trees to make more ladders, and the trees are not cooperating. <laughs> the uh, the eternal struggle. There's, and eventually that means I can get rid of this janky stair, and that gives me more dirt to turn into farmland. Um, I can actually. Well. Oh no. No, no. I was gonna say no phantoms yet, but that's that. That's how you make the bad things actually happen. No, I had phantoms. Yeah, I have not had phantoms yet. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. Although, uh, while some, while some mobs do climb up ladders, dolphins are not one of them. Apparently, though, creepers will, and that's how you end up having a very, very bad day. Yeah, yeah. You, you saw you that episode? The did you? Sign again. I had to replace the dirt it was on. Uh, you you just type slash is on the sign. It won't look as pretty, but it will still be functional. Okay. Right, was it six in the morning that they stopped? Uh... Yeah. Okay. Because I, I need to... I need to start growing foods and stuffs again. Yeah. Well, it doesn't matter how smart you are. Gravity does not care how smart you are. Yes, rest. I'm forgetting which buttons do what. I'm getting ah. my games confused. Yeah. I hate it when that happens. Because that does happen. Okay. I don't want to count on that as a water source. I need... I need a stair. And I need a bucket of water. So what I can do... Take that out right there. Upside down stair facing this way. Water log it. That way, water's not going to flow out when I do that eventually. Not, oh, too far, too far, too far. Which means that's going to stay hydrated. Unfortunately, it means I'm not going to get much in the way of sugar gain. But I can at least do that. Mm. I can get... How do I want to do this? That'll at least get me a loaf of bread. And that'll get me a loaf of bread. go that far. Alright. Challenge is I should be able to get the first sugar cane planter, because that just requires you to plant for sugar cane. Ta-da! That gives me four dirt. I'm going to need three for there. 
which means I can at least get two more dirt in my 9x9. Nine nine. <laughs> Actually, I'm overthinking this. Hush. I don't want to hear it. Hush. Never. The whole area in that 9x9 nine nine doesn't have to actually be usable or growable area. Get a shovel. And I can put I can put this away for now. Oh. Oh, that's asking for stuff to get lost. Okay. Let's build a safety net. Carefully. <laughs> very, very carefully. No. In real life, I would not go anywhere near these heights. Or any heights. <laughs> I would get into the engineering, but not the <laughs> not the actual construction. Not even a little bit. Nope. <laughs> that that is nothing but nope. work with just that and more cobblestone there's gonna be a whole lot of offline <laughs> you, you know when most minecraft youtubers go so i did some mining off camera uh this is gonna be so i sat afk at the cobble generator off camera yep a whole lot of that or <laughs> or so I listened to the audiobook version of World and Peace, and I now have enough. <laughs> That's rough. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I forgot about that. That's good though. I like that. Hey, only a Come on, come on, give me an apple. Give me an apple. Give me the apple. This is going to be one of those things like the trident was, isn't it? Yes. Yes, it is. I don't care if you guys have 37 apples. Tag on it, I'm not taking them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Almost nighttime. <sighs> and no apples. Day 874. No apples in sight. Still no apples. <laughs> Alright, while well, I'm waiting for that to do something useful. Um, and the light level here should be... That's going to be six. Did I measure this out wrong? Because the inside of that should be seven, not six. What if I move these diagonally in one? Because a light level below 7 means that things you don't want to spawn there can. And that's how sad days happen. You start singing uh, Alice in Chain lyrics about how you fell on bad days. and I mean, since we're dialing up the Wayback Machine. Uh, yes, they do have ice buildings and areas. Uh, we won't be able to get those until much later on. Alright, that is late level 8. Uh, I think that's actually a little higher than I want. But I'll go with it for the moment. Alright, so I got those guys growing. Um... I forgot I need I still need to plant some melons and pumpkins let's get a melon going there a pumpkin going there a melon going there and a pumpkin going there. And let's hope that they don't trample my uh, wheat. Matter of fact, the next time it grows, I'll probably take that guy and move it over there. Just... Oh! Oop. Oop. Oops. Somebody stood outside just a little too long. Hey, you got phantoms. I got friends. And they're not in low places. Yeah, we don't have any spider webs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, with enough iron, we can make the, the phantom trap like we did in Season 1. <laughs> Thank you, One-Winged Angel. Uh, there, oh, there was a, uh, there was another, on a Daily Tech News show, there was a good pre-show discussion about uh about some of the classic songs from scorpions and a few others and yeah it was good well depending on <laughs> depending on how good your memory was All right, let me get another one of those guys let's put oh. Let's put the valuable stuff away for a moment. I'll put those up there eventually. Oh. Um. My poor 
poor brain. What was I about to do? The world may never know. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could go down to the bottom of the earth and uh, start building out that platform a little bit more. I got sky coverage out to one, two, three, four blocks out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I like Nirvana. Then I decided to never mind. No. Uh, I, I think the one that really got me was was not you really got me, but um, somebody was having audio problems. And I can't remember if it was a Coffee Craft stream or a Games Revisited stream. Somebody, somebody was having some audio problems and all I could think to do was sit there and start going intergalactic intergalactic and, and yeah unfortunately nobody who was watching understood the Beastie Boys reference and uh <laughs> that that made me sad then I had to actually look up when Beastie Boys released intergalactic and uh I, I believe I have intentionally forgotten that because I really d probably don't want to think about that too hard. Because <laughs> uh, that was a minute ago. I really wanted to remember. Okay, Google. When did the Beastie Boys release Intergalactic? Nineteen ninety eight. Nineteen ninety eight. Uh, I hadn't finished high school yet. Thanks. <laughs> Sorry. I had, already, I had already gone to college, joined the military, and was uh, uh, medically retired from the military by then. What, by 98? She named it. Yes. Really? Yes. I'm sorry. I, 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 as a matter, I, fact, as a matter I, of fact, my oldest son was born in 2000. I, I I thought we were a little closer in age than that. <laughs> Otherwise, I wouldn't have gone Appreciate there. It. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have gone there if I'd known. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, man. What can I do to... Stop those guys from popping out there. They're they're falling through that hole, but I want to keep that there. So I've got somewhere for the pick to go that's not going to break the object that's behind. Well, I mean, All right, what's the command to turn off the durability thing? Uh, slash trigger duraping, and then you can hit the to bring up the talk and you can click the little switches to turn things on and off. Oh, uh, there, there there are moments where, you know, some experiences were very, very uh, hard-earned. Uh, on the other hand, uh, yeah, it, it's been an interesting uh, trip on this little celestial merry-go-round. Sometimes I think the theme song playing in the background is Merry Go Round Broken Down, but. <laughs> oh, man. Trigger, Duraping, and then I'm supposed to hit what now? Just tap enter, and it'll bring up uh -huh. the menu. And then you can tap T and it will let you click on the things that popped up in chat to turn them on and off. It's a little less than intuitive, 
but they were trying to keep it so that way you could use it in plain vanilla Minecraft. Okay. There you go. Yeah, I'll, I'll, between now and next live stream, I'll actually remove the data pack entirely since it doesn't seem to be working right. It's going to require a reboot, though, so. That's oh, all right. When it comes to the age stuff, Reyes is always there to remind me that I am the older brother. It's my job. Always there to remind him. <laughs> All right. Um. Is it daylight yet? No. Ah, actually, I think I stole that from you. Stole what from? Family now. So we're, hmm? we're family now, so that makes me the oldest brother. <laughs> <laughs> that is not a wrong statement. No, that's not wrong. What are you growing over there? What is he growing that's over where? Well, I'm looking. I'm looking over at Medic's Island, and I'm telling you, dude, it's the Taco Bell Tower. Just the, the plants are looking a little weird. Of course, there's Arcadius with an actual, like, designed house and everything. Uh, yeah, you're welcome. I'm working on it. Yeah, <laughs> I'll, I'll get to that part eventually. It is one of the challenges, so I will, I do need to do that at some point. How do they know if you made a house? Uh, you have to have a roof, a door, and a bed. Yeah. How? Do, wait a minute, if you have a bed then that means you could be sleeping through the night. Yep. I could. Are you choosing oh, the Oh, they're, they're drumsticks. That is your hunger. So the hearts on the left is your life. The little number in the middle is your level. The bar below it is your XP bar. And the little haunches, they're, they're like little meat haunches. Uh, that is your hunger level. You need to have full haunches before you can regen hearts. When your hunger level drops below a certain level, you won't regenerate health when you take damage. And because we're playing in hard mode, you can starve to death as well. So uh, <laughs> be careful on those AFK sessions. Because we didn't more need more problems on this server. Well, that's the way it was last go round too. No, I'm just saying like... Yeah. This is starting to sound like playing a game pandemic. Do this and you die. Or do this and you die. Or do this and you know what you could do? You can die. You could die. No, no. Th this is still easier than pandemic. <laughs> Depends on who you're playing with. I mean. Well, no, okay. That that's fair. You're not wrong for that. <laughs> I mean, like, if Reyes is actually on your side and not the super bug, <laughs> you have a decent chance of winning. <clears throat> but then again, we don't have that expansion, so I don't think we have to worry about it. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, yeah. A little bit. But eventually, what I'm going to do is this design is actually somewhat tileable. So when I get enough iron for hoppers in that space right there, I'm going to start putting, I'm going to put three hoppers. Because you'll, you'll notice you end up spending an awful lot of time breaking it and then waiting. So if you get three of these side by side with the lava in the middle of the three, the lava will spread out as it flows out. Uh, allowing you to generate three cobble at a time. 
and then you can stand there and even if you're waiting for that you can be breaking the block behind it and the hoppers will pick it up um if you've got an actual source of lava which you know more than just the one bucket you can actually set these up so that way they're five or six deep and that is about as far as you can go and actually have a chance of harvesting all of them before some other one regenerates in front of you. Um, the only problem is uh, at five... <laughs> Uh, five five out of fifty hoppers. I do not want having tied up in a cobblestone generator. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. What was that? What was what? That sigh of exasperation. I'm counting. And that makes you exasperated? Yeah. My design's not coming out as pretty as I want. No. It's functional, but... Still no apple. Oh, and now my axe broke. yet either. I guess I can actually uh, grab three dirt and get rid of these guys too. Gamma. Oh, that was a mistake. need light too? Yes. Okay. I will continue this pattern. <sighs> it might not be the most sci-crafty of things, but... Sci-crafty? Is that the, uh... Yeah. Is that the adjective now? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You knew what I meant when I said it, right? I did. Okay. Uh, it, it's, uh, it's not so much that the apples are glitched, it's just when it comes to random number generators, we, we have a disagreement about, you know, <laughs> when my number's up. Wait, let me rephrase that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You know what I miss? What? Having tools with a decent durability. Mm. Fair. But uh, yeah. Even even when we're playing D and D, and by all rights, statistically speaking, I I should have a decent chance of a decent roll. Um, let's just say that's not how it works out, and be sad with that. I mean, sad with that. I 
do that. That's only going to be... Two blocks worth of water spawning? I mean, that might be enough. I'm pretty sure that's enough. Most of the squid farms are only too high. I think I'm actually going to want more than that, though. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll do more than that. Uh, but that means that I'm not going to be able to use that to hydrate the croplands there. I start getting the other saplings I'm going to make a different kind of tree farm so this space can be repurposed eventually as soon as I get the cobble together I'm going to make a dark room for the mushrooms here I just need the puzzle which I need the spruce for which I need a second apple for It's 10 o'clock. It's way longer than I normally go. Let me do this. Let me go Island, Warp, Arcadius. Start taking a peek around. Hello. Oh, you, oh, you just glitched out on me there. Hello, God boy. Hey, how's it going? Oh, oh shit. Oh yeah, that's right. I can't look at the... Uh... Oh, okay. I like that design. Similar, but you can you can actually operate it from either side. Mm-hmm. And all the storage is reachable from inside the house. Yeah, nice. I, I take a look, but I can't because I'm on my regular account, not my admin account. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And is that your water elevator down? Yeah, I haven't done much other than make a giant platform down there. Hey, I haven't done much more than that either. <laughs> I'm surprised you're not doing the 2x2 two two jungle to get uh, some vines or stuff. Not yet. Not I yet. Don't have, you know, I don't have the ability to keep the vines, so what's the point? Uh, uh, well, oh yeah, that's right. No iron for shears. Mm-hmm. Shears, no silk touch. Nope. Oh, your spawn's up here on the roof. Uh, no, I changed it. Uh, did you change... For me, anyways. Uh, did you change your home, or... Oh, <laughs> I can't get through the gate. <laughs> That's alright, I'll get around it. Um, uh, hold on a second. Did, did you change the warp point? Uh, no. Ah, then that's it. No, no, go away, go away, go away, go away. Go away go that away. that's why that's why I went under uh <laughs> under a roof. I just realized it was nighttime. Is this your fish tank? Uh oh no, but thank you. Yay, yay, yay. <laughs> no, this is actually my cobblestone generator, my fish tank slash uh um jacuzzi is over here. See, I just sit in here and you know, wait for the fishies to come up. <laughs> Oh, they spawn in the water column? Uh-huh. Nice. Then they come up just like they did over there. Uh, actually, this is my current generator. Okay. But once I get everything moved like I'm wanting to move, then I've already started a stairway spiral down. That's going to become my I need to get to the bottom level thingy. Ah, uh, so you're doing a spiral stairway? Yeah, but it still has a lot of work to do. 
Oh, yeah. Uh, and, of course, I've been harvesting all this dark oak, and you, I'm you, uh, almost to the point... I, I can't look in the chest. <laughs> oh. Well, I'm almost to the point to where I can make the big spruce trees and when i get to that point then the house is going to start going up yeah there, there's a lot of stuff that i'm waiting on the uh yeah oh no we, we are worried about cobbling enough cobble together oh, oh. and i also uh made a little path all the way out towards that person's island i don't know whose it is that's mine and there appears to be a creeper over there i'm surprised yep. you didn't use uh bottom slabs for that Nope, I did that on purpose. Oh, because you want hostile mobs to run over to my island? Not unless you want to connect up to it. Hey, tree, thank you. Uh, that is something that Reyes wanted to do, was to make a skyway between the different, uh, between the different islands, just for the fun of it. Well, if that happens, then I will uh, change it. Yay! Membrane. I don't know why I was jumping. It wouldn't let me get it. For... Insane in the membrane. Oh. Oh, no. That was, that was a minute ago, too. Quiet. <laughs> what was... Insane in the membrane? I hear him. You almost had it. You almost had it. I want to go to rest, but she's already warned me that uh, that is the least safe at night. It's a lot least safe at night. How low do fishies yeah. have to go? What do you mean? Get fishies. Uh, you just need a big enough body of water. Squid spawn below... 40, I think it is. Yes. Yeah. Yes, one winged angel. And those things that were flying at us, those are phantoms. Uh, when I forget which update it was that they were introduced in, but prior to it, Mo Yang held a vote for which mob they were going to add. And the winner of the popular vote was the Phantom, which lots of people thought was going to be all sorts of fun and an interesting mechanic, and now gets endlessly complained about, even though it's what they voted for. I don't complain Goats? about it. I think what? It, I think it brings <laughs> out a... Uh, you know, I, I, I'm okay with Phantoms. I, I'm okay with Phantoms. They, they do get annoying. And, and early game, they definitely are uh, <laughs> something special. Uh, but it keeps you on your toes. Uh, they do keep you on your toes. Yeah, I just noticed you're doing all this with solid blocks or top slabs. No, these are top slabs. Okay. Uh, I want this whole area spawnable. That's why I put the gate and stuff around my my side. That's yours, by the way. Those are your guys. But that's why I. I don't know. They're on your stuff. island. <laughs> Really? <laughs> oh, is that how we're playing this? <laughs> nope. <laughs> okay. Okay. Totally warping over to a non for the rest of the night. <laughs> yeah, but you, what you don't understand is I'm about to make sure that my island is always completely covered. <laughs> that is, I. That's why I put a. Uh, a cap on top of the where the water elevator is because I'm eventually going to get the ladder going up and have a roof over the entire thing. Yeah, I haven't heard anybody complaining about the goats yet. Unfortunately, the goats are also not fully implemented. With the release of 1.17, the mob chosen by popular vote was the Mountain Goat. Um, they 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 are a neutral mob, which means they're not immediately hostile, but you can make them attack you. Uh, they will, if you stand still long enough in their area, they will randomly ram you. 
and send you flying off in a given direction. Uh, if you can get them to ram a solid object like a tree or a stone wall or something, they will drop a goat horn. What that is useful for, nobody has said yet, and it doesn't matter because that part hasn't been implemented yet either. Uh, they're also, if I remember right, one of the few mo No, can they go over powdered snow? Or is that just the rabbits? Rabbits and foxes. No, they can travel over it. Okay. Because there is a powdered snow that you can actually sink through in 1.17, and mountain goats, rabbits, and foxes don't sink in it. But you will, unless you're wearing leather boots. Which I am very happy about, because it actually gives a purpose to having leather boots other than, you know, this was the first thing I could find. Well, I mean, <laughs> does it need another purpose other than it's the first thing I could find? I mean... Well, yeah. I I, I, I like making sure that stuff remain useful throughout the entire course of your run. Like, that's why I was so happy that for the Piglin Trading Hall, you need gold. Because it makes gold actually useful. And not just in the initial, but throughout the entire what? run of the game. Gold is always useful throughout the whole game. For what? Either making for a beacon? Golden apples, golden carrots. Yeah, you mean beacons if you're crazy. I don't use ever use golden apples and golden carrots. So um, I use golden apples for for villager trading. Exactly. But that's about it. And. Nope. Oh, and you're, okay. You're giving me a hard time about the MC Escher style. What? <laughs> <laughs> that depends on what does it all. I'm not done yet. I'm still trying to build my mound so that I can what, dig. What is going on back here? Back where? On the other side of your cobble farm. Is that your fish pen? My endless water pool. Ah. I wasn't sure if you were trying to make a fish farm over here. No, it's my endless water pool. And you're still dead set on making a uh, solid cobble column and digging down? Yeah. Okay. So, island info. Reyes is at level 40. Wow. Arcadius is at level 8. Medic is at level 9. Almost at 10. And I am probably running in 4th place there. No, I'm at level 11. Although, honestly, the the levels are nice and all, but mo I, well, I am curious to see, to make sure everybody's custom ore generator is actually generating things other than cobble. Um, is that? Well, ask for us. You should be getting something. Yeah. I got granite. Oh, oh, okay. Sorry. The perspective was killing me. I thought I thought that hot mess of cobble and water was coming out of my island. And I was like, wait a second. I didn't... Oh, no. That, that's Medic's Island beyond mine. <laughs> that you hot guys, mess you, of... <laughs> you guys keep giving me crap. That's okay. Hey. He's making fun of me, but obviously I'm doing something okay. Mm-hmm. You are. So, it's cool. He can hate. Hater's gonna hate. Hello, melon slices. And Jubba gonna snore. Well, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
He does that. Doing it right Aww, now. I have an apple that glitched. Uh, if you can get up to where it would uh, where it started falling from, you should be able to still catch it. Oh, weird. <sighs> Tree number eight hundred and seventy-two. No apples in sight. What else doesn't grow dumb? Birch doesn't grow dumb. Define grow dumb. Creative. Uh, no, birch do. The only ones that grow, the only one that grows in a very unpredictable pattern is the oak sapling. The acacia grows relatively predictable, all things considered. The jungle tree will get one random large branch in one of the four cardinal directions. Uh, but spruce, dark oak, birch will all grow very predictably. That's part of why I like the using sand, birch. Hmm? Does the sand need a water source? Depends on what for, you're planting uh, on. For cactus? No, not cactus. for cactus. No. Uh, if you're putting sugar cane on it, it does, but not for cactus. Okay. Apple? No. Time to go fishing, maybe. Without suffocating. How far down do you have to make your pool for fishies? Uh, I, I'm not sure how deep it has to be, to be honest. I... Did I get the cut head on that one? <laughs> yeah. No, the, the apples won't generate from the cobble generator. They only fall from oak and dark oak. Uh, I only got, got three apples on that one. That's the wrong box. Make sure we get an extra melon seed just in case. Uh, practically keep watch of which both. Keeping an eye on the trees and the cobble? Not the way I've got it right now. Where I had it earlier, I could keep an eye on the tree growth and mine cobble, but right now, not so much. But that's because I wanted to make sure that when I was uh, generating cobblestone, uh, it was in a safe place so the phantoms didn't get me. I'm also trying to get enough wheat growing that I can maybe eat a little more bread. And... Uh, I think I think there one of the challenges is for wheat as well. Yeah, this the But that's that not I until not Yeah, there's a wheat farmer, but that's not until the next level. Once I complete novice builder, then I can get that. What was that medic? I said my my wheat's taking forever to grow. Two, three, four. Might as well get started on that roof over here too. I know I got more cobble under there. Cobble, cobble, cobble. 
What's going to be really fun is when I finally get a decent supply of something more than cobble. And uh, I need to start ripping out cobble to put in the better stuff. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what you're asking with that question. The challenges keep track of what you've done in the past in that I have done the cobblestone generator one time. It, it doesn't tell me what that one time was. It just tells me that to complete it the second time, I need 66 cobble. Um, because it doesn't have the funky enchant glow, it shows that these are not yet completed. And then once I complete the novice builder, then it will unlock anything that requires novice builder to unlock. Um, except for that one, which also requires the stone brick maker to unlock. And except that one, which requires the homeowner to unlock. Did that make sense? I hope that made sense. I think somewhere there's also... Uh, oh no, that log's not that... Uh, I thought there might have been a log somewhere. No, not restart. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Yeah. That's a good way to rage quit right there. Yeah. I mean, Grant, you're only a day in. You'll be fine. No. No. No, because apparently I'm like 40 levels behind. No. Uh, we all are. Mm-hmm. That's okay. Next, next time I know that... uh. When we start Skyblock in season like eight, then uh, all I gotta do is just build columns down to the ground repeatedly. <laughs> <laughs> it, it it does depend a little bit on uh, if we play you Skyblock again or if we play a different version of Skyblock, because there are other ones. I I I had considered playing uh, Iridium. Which is nice, but I don't like it when you say that. That doesn't sound good. Uh, it's just very, very complex. I just realized what's the what's the light level over here? Eight. Okay. That should be good on both sides there. Oh, you know what? Let's get that right over the elevator there. <laughs> I really need to get a proper spot for this cactus because I'm not getting cactus grow three high and I don't have enough space for cactus to grow in there. I've got two more sand that I can start dedicating to it, but I really want to have a better, a better spot for it. Uh, it doesn't help that this is not really the best light level either. Oh, that is part of a data pack I found that changes the shape of the sun to be a block. Because I like it and it keeps it a little more consistent with the Minecraft theme of everything being a block. The The default Minecraft one does not actually look like that. It, it's a... I don't know how to describe it. Actually, let me go options, resource packs, turn off everything but the server one. That's what it looks like by default. So I, I kind of like it having a little bit more of the, the cubed look. And same for the moon. Uh, I probably shouldn't go running around jumping either. 
That seems unwise. A little bit. A little bit, yeah. There, there are other data packs that act, add, like, uh, an actual round sun and moon, or as close to round as Minecraft gets, in a game dedicated to 8-bit uh, blockiness, or 16-bit blockiness. Eventually, I'll be able to show off some of the other customizations we've made. Um... Like, we have it set up so that way the tamed dogs look like black labs. Uh, we've got some customizations on the uh, totems of undying. And a few, you know, a few other, a few other little tweaks that are all our own. Or close to. Losing more cobble than I want to. All right. Well, level twelve. What's gonna? What's giving me the best uh, bang for the buck there? Actually, everything that we're working with is weighted... No, not weighted. Yeah, weighted about the same. Never mind, then. Yeah, uh, Totem of Undying is uh, an object that if you have it held in your hand when you die, it prevents you from dying. Yeah, I know. Oh, 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 come here, fishy. Get him. Oh, his stuff fell out of the water stream. All right. This is like my third time going. I really should call it a night. Well, maybe let me do one more thing real quick. Uh, oh, I got, a, I got two diorites. <laughs> okay. So, so at least it is working. That, because again, that was one of my concerns. Ooh, ooh. I'm falling faster than the fish. This is uh this is opening day season two, so uh you know we can make it a twenty four hour stream. <laughs> <laughs> nah. 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 I, I still got that work thing that has to happen. <laughs> hey, yes, that's what sick days are for. Uh no, I actually I I don't. Nah, I got end of month billing. Well, I would have said that's what co-workers are for, but I... <laughs> no, my new ones are good. It was the old ones that were yeah, yeah. different. Uh, <laughs> different? That's what we're going to go with? I haven't exactly had the greatest time with co-workers. I've had a couple of good ones, but... Actually, yeah, instead of setting up the fish farm up there, I may set it up down here. That That is both sad and disturbing. What? Uh, and the dolphins falling to their death. Oh, that's not sad at all. Look, I mean, I know they're a bad team, but still, they, they deserve to die with sudden dignity. I'm trying to remember which podcast I was listening to, but one of the hosts was shocked to finally learn in the year of our Lord 2020 that the Hootie and the Blowfish lyric was that the dolphins make him cry. I got two string. Woo! Oh, from a spider? Well, on your way. Yep, that's what I've been. Oh, bone meal. Beautiful. Is what I've been waiting for. 
Yeah, no, I'm going to make an actual proper mob grinder. I'm not going to mess with half measures. One, two, three, four. Well, two. I will too, but not tonight. <laughs> not tonight. No, you got to say that more ominously. Uh, I almost have a full chest of cobble, and once I do, <laughs> that's my project. Yeah, that, that's going to be one of those, well, while I'm not on camera, I'll go... Man, you're right about just sitting outside of a water stream waiting for the fish to fall. Told you, man. That's how I got all my food. <laughs> they, like, literally just come to you like, Cook me, please! Like, that's another dozen cod right there. And a couple of ink and some bone meal. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but no, I... Uh, that definitely seals it. Instead of trying to make my fish farm up there and figure out how to jam it in the small space I had available, I am totally going to build that down here. Matter of fact, what I think I'll do is I'll set it up. I'll set it up near the mob farm itself. So that way, while I'm over at the mob farm, I can let the fish farm generate more fish for me too. Oh yeah, I forgot that when Dolphin die, they leave Raw Cod. I mean, mm -hmm. it, it would be extra wrong if they left Tuna. You're not funny. <laughs> mahi, mahi. <laughs> I'd really like some salmon, though. Could we get some salmon to fall? Or is that only in the ocean? I think that's only in the ocean. Well, no, because they, they spawn in the swamps, too. Mm-hmm. Change your biome. You'll be okay. Yeah, I can't do that yet. Can't? Nope. You got to get to certain levels. Oh, I thought you just could do it. <laughs> My bad. Uh, it's there on the menu, but you have to unlock the ability. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That, that's one of your rewards for completing some of the uh, challenges is the ability to access different biomes. Good one, one wing. I like it. Yeah. Ooh, another apple. Oh, hush. The other thing I gotta figure out is where I'm gonna put the passive mob farm. Because if you set, I, I think I think I'm gonna have to do that down below, which means I'm gonna have to figure out how to get grass from up there to down there. Sadly, that's where something like rest or medics build is is gonna have a, a much easier time. Um, but stairs stepping it down. Well. It, what you can do is you can put a dirt, a torch, and then a dirt on top of that torch and column up that way. And uh, it will it will move down eventually. It's the eventually part I, that... If I could just get a hold of one soul sand and some kelp, <laughs> I wouldn't be stair-stepping anything down. Yeah. That comes later. At least the food's starting to fall into place. I wonder how many of those I'm going to accumulate before the season's over. Godheads? Yeah. I'm at two right now. All right, so how many how many people remember the old Saturday Night Live fish head? Fish heads, fish heads, holy holy fish heads. <laughs> <laughs> at least one. 
Yeah, I had mm -hmm. a cot head on, but then I purposely jumped off the thing and forgot I had it on, and now I don't have it no more. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> That's so uh, sad. Yes, One-Winged Angel, uh, all the... All the Animal mobs have a chance to a percentage chance to drop a player head, a mob head, like those guys. So, uh, but only if the player kills them. So, if the player kills a squid, there's a percentage chance for a squid head. Um, yeah, Saturday Night Live's been really hit or miss for the entirety of its run. So, when it's on, it's on, and when it's not, uh, it's there. Farley, what? Uh, even some of his were were a little hit or miss. I I mean, in a van down by the river, dude was was awesome. But but that's what I that that's what I'm getting at. They had certain skits and things, like the the Jeopardy, the whole all the Jeopardy skits were they were good. <laughs> uh, but those weren't the only skits that they did, and they didn't do all of those back to back to back either. Uh, yes, a phantom head is a thing. Well, depending on your luck and percentage chance and... Uh, yeah, yeah. Now, you can increase your percentage chance by using a sword with the looting enchantment. Uh, each level of looting increases the percentage chance by 1-3% to 3 depending on what it's calculating or what it's trying to figure out. They, they keep messing with what looting affects and how it affects it, so I, I'm a little fuzzy on the numbers. Well, let's be honest, I'd be a little fuzzy on the numbers even if they weren't changing it all the time, but we're, we're not going to go there. Cook. There we go. Any tree screw? Oh, tree screw. Beautiful. Can I get my second apple before the stream is over? You haven't even finished your first bundle yet? Huh? I, I haven't gotten my second apple yet. And what do you mean by a first bundle? I, I didn't know if you had actually done the first apple turn in yet. No. I, I'd have to actually, you know, get apples <laughs> from these trees <laughs> that produce apples. Your luck strikes again, good sir. Uh-huh. Oh, there it is. Yay. Yay! Let's not jump around. That's how you fall down. <laughs> you jump off with the apple in your hand. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, be, no. Yeah. Be all golem style, jumping around. My precious. My precious. No. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! There we go. Congratulations. Hot diggity. Okay. Let's I get. Can actually, do something with the twenty-five apples I have. <laughs> oh gosh. I've been saving them just in case you might need them. Let's get that spruce growing right now. And let's get a birch growing over there. Oh, come on. Don't do... Don't... Don't what? Don't stop leaving? I have a bunch of spruce mm. saplings on the ground mm -hmm. but I can't pick them up because they're glitched so oh. I gotta t tower high up in the air again to get to them and let's get a jungle going right there because those are the things that I would like those are a few of my favorite things Ooh, that 
was a good harvest. <laughs> yeah, I just had a bunch of Seven, stuff. Hmm? 17 spruce saplings. Ooh. Ooh. Nice. On one tree. Giant tree, I take it? Yep. Actually, no. Let's not turn that into bread, since I seem to have enough cook cod to keep me going for a little while. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't see those two over there by the melons. Uh, or those over by the melons. 21. <laughs> nice. Jeez. A one big tree. 21. But it did turn everything around it in Podzol. Yeah. Yeah, that happens. Mm. Careful, don't lose your grass. Oh, yeah. Woo, I'm glad that I have one grass block over here left. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> now, I, my sugar cane, my sugar cane has grass blocks under it. Okay. Yeah, that would have been bad. Yeah. Oh, that was almost... Yeah, that's that's why I got... That, that's why I set where the where the spruce is gonna go all the way over here surrounded by the giant cobble barrier in part because I want this to turn into uh, podzol so I can start growing mushrooms yeah because uh, the idea is I'm gonna turn this into a dark room just dark enough for mushrooms to grow but not so dark that mobs spawn and then come in with the uh, with the bone meal and just bone meal the giant mushrooms so I can get tons of uh, tons of them and start making some mushroom soup. Hello, fishy. I like the fishes. They're so delicious. Of course, I can't help but notice that now that my stated goal is completed, I'm still running around like, hmm. <laughs> and, and he uh, and to be and here I was worried that uh, nobody was going to be excited about Skyblock, and I was the only one who <laughs> who was looking forward to playing it. Oh, I'll be honest. Yeah, with you. weirdo. I, I wasn't at first. Until I got on it and, and started playing it, I'm like, oh, I like this. It is I a, wasn't excited at first. It is a very unique challenge. That is for sure. Alright, it's a race to build a roof before the phantoms come. <laughs> roof built. All right, Mr. Spruce. Any day now. <laughs> oh, my. Yeah. I think a little bit later, I'll raise this roof up a little bit higher and put my house on top of that. So this will go all the way up to the to the top into the house. Um, Is the roof? Mm-hmm. I'll keep building out this patch here for farming. Uh, I'm gonna have to find a couple more places to hide water sources, though, so I can keep it all hydrated, properly hydrated. I got to remember how far how far hydration is. It's what eight eight blocks out. An eight block spread? Uh, yes. <laughs> you, you sound about as confident as I do. Four. It's four each direction. Uh, oh, no. Okay. Oh, so it's a diamond four out from the center? Correct. Okay. Yeah, I know. 
Uh, but to be honest, I, I wasn't that positive about it either. It's not usually one of the things that I have to worry about. Um, but since I, I'm still doing a lot of manual farming, I won't be able to do the kind of automatic farming that I want until I can either get a villager or some redstone. Um, at which point I'll, I'll be able to, uh, to, to take my farming up to the next level. Although, I'm going to have to look at some of the challenges, because I think some of the challenges are actually based off of having actual farmland being used. Like, there, there are some challenges that, that you have to have, like, so many wheat plants planted kind of deal, if I remember right. And even odds as to whether or not I actually remember right. Well, maybe tomorrow I will take some time to actually look at all the challenges, because I haven't done that. Uh, well, you can't see all the challenges until you unlock their tier. I've seen all the challenges because I was running through the code for the plugin to make sure that things were going, that it was going to provide us blocks that were relatively new. Because like I said at the top of the live stream, one of my issues with you skyblock is that it is very rooted in some old mechanics like one of the one of the challenge rewards is an ocelot spawn egg because at the time the plugin at, at the time it was written that was the only way to get a cat was to tame an ocelot uh the the objective yes you can get the villagers to work for you as well as trade with them um, work for you is a, is a strong term. I, I don't necessarily know that that's the right wording. Yeah, it is. Uh, we're not going to miss. It is. <laughs> They're working for me. Mm. Um, and, and the iron farm challenge is another one that I, I've already mentioned it twice, but I'll, I'll mention it again. It, it's. Uh, the original, before I modified it, was to get 10 villagers and 30 oak doors. Which was how you built a mine farm before 1.13 or 1.14. It was in the middle of Season 0 that it changed. And we started Season 0 on 1.13, so yeah, that would make it 1.14 that it changed. I hate that I get a step through my memory like that. No, it's neither a salve nor a slave. We, we give them a profession. Go it is their job. I mean, you know, everybody's got to have a job. They do get paid. Mm -hmm. I mean, emeralds. I mean, yeah, they, they get paid. Sort of. I mean, if, if we don't like how much they're charging us, we, we turn them into zombies and then turn around and save them. Yeah. And, you know, <laughs> they'll lower the price for us. I mean... Because we saved them. <laughs> I, you know, slave is such a harsh word. Save. I think, I think it's save labor. Yeah, I mean, because, yeah. you know... What kind of life would they really have had if we didn't step in and help them? Yeah, villager trading is a big component, and it's why I, it's part of why I'm curious. Because in vanilla, in vanilla Minecraft, there's no limit to the number of villagers you can have, so it's nothing to have a villager tied up in a carrot farm, a villager tied up in a potato farm, a villager tied up in a wheat farm. Um, but when your entire island is capped at 16 villagers maximum having a villager tied to just one task is a different endeavor entirely. And three of them have to go towards the iron farm if you're going to have one. Uh, six if you want the achievement. It might tie it up. Yeah, um, uh, well, I mean... Oh, no, they're, they're working. I mean, they, they were given a job, and their job is to plant and harvest the crop. And... and you know, they get some of it, and you get most of it. So it's very governmental <laughs> like that. 
<laughs> Just think of like taxes. It's okay. So yeah, I, I'm I I'm trying to figure out if there's a way that I can build an iron farm and still have the villagers accessible for trading. And I'm not I'm not quite sure how to go about that. I've got a couple of ideas, but it's going to take actually like maybe going into a creative world and sketching them out. Um, and, and trying to figure out like, uh, if I built a trading hall under a platform that was spawnable for golems, but in an area where no golems could spawn, you know, would I be able to use the trading hall as a trading hall and then, uh, get the golems to, to get pushed off into, uh, and buy the farm. So we're we're back to again one one of the things that I am excited about is this is a chance to really um, learn and dig into the mechanics of Minecraft and figure out how stuff works. I love watching guys like Tango Tech and Impulse and uh, all the all these people who understand Minecraft mechanics way better than I do. Um. And it's by doing stuff like this that they learned, you know. Pickaxes. My kingdom for another eight pickaxe. Oh, by the way. Where am I at? Ah, still not there yet. lumber. Let's see. How big a fish farm do I want? All the fishes. You know what? Since everything else seems to be in the 9x9 format, 9x9 boxes, let me go ahead and make 9x9. You know it's 11, right? No, I didn't know that. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let, let me put the lumber away and then plan another day. Although. <laughs> although. Do, no spruce? No spruce. But I have jungle. Come on. Jungle saplings. I'd like some vines, please. Again, we come back to how are you going to harvest those vines? Hey, details, details. <laughs> I didn't say I was going to grow them right away. Just after I get a couple of iron for shears. Yeah, like your first iron's going anywhere except into a hopper. Well, I mean... Oh! Oh, you dirty, rotten tree! I didn't get a sapling! Ah. You start collecting more apples. <laughs> ah! <laughs> what tree? Uh, the jungle tree. Sorry. Maybe that's what it was. I didn't go boop when I, you know. No. You know, you knock it a lot, but... But results are... I'm just saying. I'm three points away from 50. Uh, weren't, weren't, weren't you the one who was telling me that, you know, it was going to be... Is Skylord even achievable? 
yeah, that was before I realized that my stubborn concept of I'm not going to go down a dangerous water column, I'm going to make a block of land mm-hmm. was really valuable. <laughs> At least we're getting started off. I can't argue with you there. I mean, now whether it's long-term sustainable, I don't know. You know I don't understand half the things about this game. Well, no, I I can guarantee you it's not long-term sustainable. Uh, Just because there are diminishing returns programmed into the calculation. So it's one point for up until you reach a certain cap. I just don't remember all the numbers off the top of my head. But everything has a point of diminishing return. So it, so uh, so you don't sit there and do exactly that and just make a giant island block full of cobble and call it a win. Eventually, you'll reach the point where where the cobble starts giving you less and less towards the value of your island. Yep, but today is not that day. Today is not that day. <laughs> I guess I could at least put those cactus down too. That'll count, right? That adds more value. <sighs> Alright. Yeah, no. I, I need to... Alright, let me... Uh... back to spawn. Yes, in round one she has cobbled together a victory for herself. Aww. <laughs> That's awesome. I that like was it. awful in an adorable way. <laughs> yeah, showed off at the beginning of the stream the cobble generator and the little note that, um, if you use this cobble generator, it levels with your island. Uh, thankfully, because you Skyblock only gives you the one bucket of lava, if you accidentally obsidian it, you can convert it back around. Um, <laughs> I like that it reminds you that mobs don't spawn on half slabs. I hate that they don't mention specifically that it is bottom slabs. They will spawn on top slabs. Um... And it is below level 64. Octopuses spawn below level 64. So if you want black ink, <clears throat> rest, <clears throat> um, you, you need to spawn the octopus in six, level 64 and below. Okay. Reminds you that slash IS gets you the primary skyblock interface. Slash C will get you straight to the challenges. Um... Everybody's got at least one slime chunk that is somewhere below level 40. Good luck with that. And you don't get any more grass than what you have. May the odds ever be in your favor. Don't podzle your entire island. Nope, I changed I changed locations away from everything. <laughs> <laughs> um you it can even podzled the the sign, gra- the grass I yeah. left for the sign. Yeah, it Looks does like that. I can go ahead and take that down now. You can do a lot more with signs than just add the, uh, no, no, the slimes are kind of like the blob. They're, they're big, chunky, blob-like things that will eventually nudge you off into a corner and kill you slowly if you AFK in the wrong spot. You sound like you have, like, experience. Yes. Or something like Digging out your hole in season zero for that village over in Bedrock. Aw, uh, now I have diggy hole stuck in my head. Diggy diggy hole. <laughs> anyway, signs can do more than just the uh, be a shortcut for the slash is command. Uh, if you put USB 
U skyblock in brackets and then the objective, it'll actually give you how far away you are from that objective. So you attach that to a chest, keep your cobble in that chest, and it will tell you how far away, and then you can actually right click the sign and it'll complete the challenge. And uh, once we get, we'll talk about the nether when we get to the nether. Nether you mind for now. And same with guardians. Eventually, after completing some of the challenges, you'll get prismarine and guardians will spawn below prismarine. So you'll be able to make a guardian farm eventually. Yay. And that's just the, the giant coffee craft. Look, that's the coffee craft that uh, Arcadius Reyes and I built for the logo and built again in the Season Zero world. I, I literally copied and pasted that out of the Season Zero world. And then forgot the carpet at the top, so I had to fix that. So that's it for the inaugural stream of Season 2. Obviously it's going good because uh, normally I stopped two hours ago. <laughs> <gasps> yes! What? what? I got a dolphin head. <laughs> Yeah, no, it, it is a that, coffee thing. It is intended to be a coffee pot. <laughs> that was almost as good as the end, the last day of season one. I finally got my chicken head. Oh, you did? Did you really? <laughs> yes, I finally got the chicken head the last day. Medic had been trying to get one for the entire season. Somebody had an early game chicken farm and got about three or four of them and just posted them up on the wall for kicks. In the public community center. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, I'm you glad you were able to, to join up, along. Yeah. Uh, this is where I'm going to wrap up. We... Oh, that's not the one I want. That's the one I want. There we go. This is where I say thank you for joining along. I'm glad you guys had fun, especially those who stuck with us towards the bitter end. Um, we do the, or I stream Tuesdays at 6.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern. Medic is going to be streaming some more now, too. <gasps> so make sure you follow X Medic Frog on Twitch. And that way you'll get notified when he goes live and he does some stuff on the CoffeeCraft server. I think Arcadius might be doing that too soon. Hopefully, mm -hmm. maybe, probably. We can work something yep. in the schedule. So follow Arcadius if you have not yet already. Uh, at some point, I got to remember to do the command thingy so that way I can get all the shortcuts up in chat. Um, <laughs> and and uh, all my live stream archives go up on my YouTube channel. I do plan on doing some more produced uh, content with you know a little more short direct kind of stuff for various builds and that sort of thing like when I go build the mob farm I'm gonna do that as part of a video so it'll be nice and tightly edited and uh, and explain how what mechanics are at play and how it's working um, and that kind of stuff so if you haven't already subscribed to the YouTube channel <laughs> And you'll see all sorts of fun stuff, including Games Revisited, which I'll stream on Friday. This Friday, starting a new series of Games Revisited. I'm going to play The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. A classic from... Oh, there Reyes goes. Achievement after achievement. No, 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 there Reyes goes. And there Reyes goes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Have fun. Enjoy. I'll see you next time. Night. Helps if you hit Night. the right button. <laughs>